Hello, hello, hello out there, internet land. How is everybody doing on this Tuesday? What the hell? What's wrong with me? Why am I streaming on a Tuesday? Well, <laughs> uh, I actually had to swap my days off this week. I'm going to go ahead and kick this. Um, my job asked me if I could swap my days off this week because uh, one of our... Uh, one of my coworkers is getting married. <laughs> and just about half the store is involved in the said wedding so uh we're a little okay not a little but a lot of short staffed so um all this kind of starts going down on thursday for them getting ready and everything so it is kind of out of my control so whatever you guys get to see me a little earlier <laughs> but uh Brachtimus, welcome in buddy it's mario party time in here this whole Tuesday instead of Wednesday thing is really throwing me off. <laughs> yeah, me too. I'm sure the rest of the week I'm just gonna, it's gonna drag because I'm used to like the second half of the week being in the second half, you know. <laughs> but oh well, not a big deal. This is uh, by no means a permanent thing. This is just for this week. Um, and then of course Saturday, unfortunately, we will not be doing D&D &D because uh, I might as well just go to the next screen. So you can watch something else other than me blabber. But anyway, I, yeah, because we're going to be going to a Halloween party at the Avenue Cafe down in, uh, well, I guess it's Lansing, Lansing, not East Lansing. It's like just west of Frandor. But anyway, uh, yeah, uh, big Halloween party. Going to have a lot of fun. I've been working on a, uh, like a pirate captain outfit for, you know, the last little bit. Y'all have seen the hat that I've worn a few times. So I decided what the hell let's build on it and got myself a nice coat. Uh, nice undershirt, got some pants, you know, all the basic stuff. Rocktimus, you mad lad. Keep up the great work on your streams, man. I always <laughs> love being here. Oh, uh, well, thank you so much. My God, 17 months, bro. That's a lot of wasted money. <laughs> uh, I appreciate it all the same, my friend. Holy smokes. That's, gosh, well over a year now at this point. Uh, at this point, I can track how long I've been uh, affiliate just by your sub subscription rate. <laughs> but yeah, um, pirate outfit. Yeah, I thought that'd be a lot of fun, and I can make stupid pirate puns all night long, and you know, clean house, just empty the place right out. You know, nobody, nobody. More beer for me, but you know. <laughs> but yeah, they're gonna have live music and stuff. It'll be super awesome. That place like embraces kind of like a gothy atmosphere for like you know October stuff. So. I'm really into that stuff. I ran with the goths in high school, so it's a little bit nostalgic. But anyway, uh, other than that, not too much news to report. I've pretty much just been taking Midas to the dog park every day because we've had some really nice days the last few days where it's not super freezing balls out. And actually today got up to 77, according to my car. So that was like phenomenal for August. Or August, geez. Look at, I'm living in the past October. <laughs> Donkey Kong freaking out down there. But, um, yeah, so uh, we went again today, and, you know, might have had a great time, met some dogs. Uh, got a few little obnoxious humpers there that get annoying, but, oh, well, it's part of the territory, I suppose. But, uh, other than that, went and visited my brother. He came home from the hospital last Thursday and got to see him and talk to him a little bit. Um, he's doing a little bit better and better, you know, as time goes on. Um... A lot better than somebody who was in his position should have been. Uh, doctors are all saying, you know, 90% of the time when somebody comes in with injuries like his, they uh, succumb to death in 72 hours. So not only is it a miracle that he lived, but he's actually able to walk short distances now. Um, I'm pretty sure he uses like a walker for those short distances, but he says he can get to the bathroom and back at least. And he's back to doing, you know... I wouldn't say relatively normal stuff. There's still a lot he can't do because even his finger grip strength ain't all that great. I guess his right hand right now is just really weak. So, But um, he's been going through physical therapy and kind of learning and getting things back because, you know, when you're laying at the hospital for a month straight, you, your muscles get atrophied. and you, <laughs> Whether or not you know or can feel them, know how to use them again or feel them, you still got to build them back up to be capable of all that. So, But, um, yeah, he's, you know cheering on for him like <laughs> i haven't had to you know knock on wood i've never been through some i've been through a car accident but thank my lucky stars uh the whole car got smoked and if he had struck me a foot closer i would probably be in a similar position as my brother if not dead but all the i don't know man i've got this this is the weirdest phenomenon my whole life is like i've always had kind of like this 
cloud of bad luck over me. I feel like a lot of bad stuff happens to me, but you know, n nine times out of 10, 99 times out of 100, however you want to look at it, like it's usually something I can get out of or at least endure or, God damn it, that Donkey Kong going nuts and <laughs> distract me every single time. But anyway, um, yeah, just, I'm f unfortunately fortunate enough, however that makes sense. You know, like I said, I can usually bounce back, or in that case of my car accident, when I was, this would have been when I was like 15, 16, like, yeah, it sucks that the car got wrecked, it sucks I got to wreck it all, but I walked away from it, like, <laughs> anyways, that's just kind of like an example of my luck, I suppose, but, um, sort of in, in my brother's case, too, unfortunately, he did succumb a lot of, uh, injuries, but, again, he's bouncing back, so, you know, good on him, keep helping him where I can, so... Yeah, I was actually hot out there. Yeah, no, it really was. So, but anyways, okay, let's uh, let's get this party started. I'm ready to party. Um, I wanted to do just something casual this week. I know we're kind of off schedule and everything, but I was kind of planning on playing this anyways because I don't know. I like to play this every now and again, like when we're between games and stuff. Like, I, I don't get to play this ever with my friends. Like we used to play it here and there on the Wii version and stuff, and we had a great time with it, but. Uh, we whenever we meet, we're usually playing D and D or doing like a board game night, or, or in this case, you know, I, I hate to say it, I might be the reason a lot of it too that we don't play Mario Party and stuff like that so much because I've been trying to get out of the house a lot more um, these past couple of years of that you know going dealing with all this heavy shit that I've been dealing with. Like I've kind of like developed this, I don't know, like a fear of missing out or something like that. I guess they call it FOMO. <laughs> um, I feel like. You know, I just, I don't know, maybe it's not, uh, maybe I'm just overthinking it, but I just, I want to get out of the house more. I want to feel included in the world. Like, I live alone with Midas now, and, you know, that's fine for the introvert battery charge, but when that battery's charged up, then it just starts getting lonely. So, I've been getting out more and, you know, not necessarily meeting people, but I like to, like, go to bars and stuff and just people watch and just, you know, <laughs> comfortably be an introvert in public, if that makes any sense. And, uh... Yeah, that's been working out pretty good. It's nice just to be around, have a couple drinks every now and again, you know, once or twice a week somewhere, and still feel like, you know, you're among life. <laughs> but on top of that, I've been taking my, again, like I said, to the dog park a lot more, and just kind of enjoying my time with him. I've been trying to give him the best life ever since, well, I, ever since I got him, really, but little bastard's off sleeping in the kitchen, I'm talking about him. <laughs> but, yeah, just trying to make him as happy as he possibly can be because he does so much for me like he's such a good dog and great company and like I, I say it all the time that little shithead's a living teddy bear so <laughs> who doesn't want to like make sure their teddy bear is leading the best life all right we're gonna do I keep saying we're gonna do story mode and I never do it um follow the story in the one player mode see I don't know how long it is is the unfortunate thing and just if it's going to be a regular old Mario party anyway, I mean... <laughs> okay, let's see what maps we haven't done yet. Bad luck seems to start right around when you're 17 to met a certain someone. Oh no, Rock, it's been long before that. You've been a blessing on my life, believe me. You're one of the few handfuls of people that have been in my life, stayed around, and not totally screwed me over. You haven't screwed me over whatsoever, so you're, like, in the pristine tier here. <laughs> not that any of my friends really have. I feel like any of my friends that screw me over, if I don't let them, you know, if we don't make an you know, issue of it and butt heads and resolve it, like, they just eventually fade away, so. But yeah, uh, no, for sure. I got a lot of old buddies, and they're all really good to me, so I really can't. <laughs> I've, I see, I'm blessed. <laughs> I, I was sort of half-joking saying that, but not really. Um, uh, wait. We didn't pick a board. Wait, what do you pick? Alright, how many people are playing? No! What is going on? Back out. Okay, confirm and... Oh, it's, it's, it's backwards. Stop! Why? B, return. Okay, God. <laughs> I want to make sure I'm hitting the right things. I want to... Did you even choose the word? Yes, okay. I see. I wanted to make sure... Sorry, I 100% just brain farted and got myself turned around. 
That is like story of my life. Okay, party mode. Sweet. Let's lock down. Where's the Comic Con you're going to this weekend? Is it where Motor City Comic Con? Yeah, it is Motor City Comic Con. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to go or not. I'm still kind of out on the field. I'm going to wait and see how I feel, I guess. Because I'll be going alone, and I don't know how I feel about if I want to mess around with all the crowd and stuff, if I'm going to just go to sightsee. Um, I, I might. I still might. I don't know. I'm debating it, too, because I uh, kind of want to roll over to my parents' house and swipe one of my dad's old records, but uh, Alice Cooper is going to be down there doing signings, and I kind of want to swipe one of my old man's records and have it signed for him and surprise him that way. Do they do it twice a year? Normally they only did it the the spring show in May, but after they started, I think it was last year? Last year and a half, I think it was. Um, they started doing two shows. I think at first it was an attempt to like lower their maximum and keep things spread out. So, you know, for COVID guidelines, so people can, I mean, you're still stuffing thousands of people in the same building, but at least the hallways were wider and stuff, and it wasn't shoulder to shoulder like it typically seems to feel. But um, the last couple times, it's felt pretty standard, but um, I think they started doing that for COVID, and then they just were like, oh, we're having still phenomenal turnout. We should just do this twice a year and make twice as much money. So they're pretty much just holding two a year. And um, since I didn't get to go to Gen Con this year, I'm just decided, screw it, I'll make the second Motor City my Gen Con this year. Although now I'm kind of like kicking myself because I'm like, do I want to go to this this weekend or do I want to hold off to the second week of November and go to, there's a uh, Grand Rapids Comic Con and freaking Keith David is going to be at that one and I'm, I really would like to meet Keith David. He's awesome. Um, you will know who Keith David is, maybe not by name if you don't already, but he voices Goliath in gargoyles the classic cartoon the deep voice really bigger, you know um he also voices like the president and rick and morty um i want to say he's in mass effect too but you know me i have zero knowledge of mass effect other than really basic shit but I, i'm pretty sure he's someone in there too uh isn't keith david anderson from mass effect there you go yeah that's him there you go anderson <laughs> but uh yeah, I thought it was a May. That is the spring show. They still do that one too, Brock. Uh, usually around May 15th, that weekend or whatever it is. Right in the middle. But um, but yeah, yeah, you got it. No, it's that real deep voice, dude. I've, you know, always, I want to say admired because that's kind of a strong word. Appreciated. I've always appreciated his voice because even as Goliath, that was just like, like legendary. I just, everything about that cartoon was just, everything hit real good. Ah, here I am geeking out about gargoyles of all things on stream, but um, just his voice in general. It's a very dramatic, very deep, like it could be a good guy, it could be a bad guy, it could be just a kick-ass narrator, like just I, everything about it's awesome. Yeah, his voice is a beast. Thank you. <laughs> as soon as he said he's the president from Rick and Morty, I knew exactly who he is. That's what I mean. If you don't know him by name, you'll know him by his voice. Like, I don't want to say he's in a lot of stuff, but he's in popular stuff, and everybody's had to have tripped over his voice at least once somewhere. Um, not like, you know, Jim Cummings or, 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 or uh, Billy West, who, you know, are basically in everything. Or even like Tress McNeil or Tara Strong or whatever. They're, they're like in everything. They're very talented actors and stuff, so... All right, uh, let's geek out about the stuff while we're actually playing the game. <laughs> Can you tell I get tunnel vision? All right, uh, no, we don't want to hear no rules. Uh, we are one human and three computers. Of course, I'm not going to be the guy I dressed up all for tonight. <laughs> all right, three characters. Chat, you know the drill. Brock, I will assume you probably want your main monkey DK up on there. It's right up there with James Earl Jones, who's not as well known. Yeah, he's just not as well known. Yeah, um, James Earl Jones. I think the first thing I heard him in, I want to say he was in Princess Mononoke. But yeah, he's another. Yeah, I agree. Absolutely. If you decide to go to the November as long as the weather good, I'll go with you to that one. No pressure, though. Uh, let me think about it. If I do go to that one, Brock, it would have to be on a Sunday, probably. Because um, I'm going to be taking the f previous 
maybe not the previous weekend, but two weekends before, I'm going to be going down to Detroit with my buddies Ryan and Tom. We're doing a Red Wings weekend and hopefully getting the suite and everything. And uh, we're going to be going uh, to that, hopefully to that big party bar that I told you guys about last year. Um, gone to it a couple times since, but I just want to be home this weekend after being gone. No, I understand. That was a big trip down there and back. Um, I might just go to both. I don't know. I love conventions. Um, I'm just iffy about going to the one over in Grand Rapids because I've only really ever driven to Grand Rapids once, and I get super itchy with driving in cities. Like, I just, like, it takes everything I've got to, like, drive to Detroit, you know, it, driving in Detroit's even worse, but, uh, usually my buddy Tom's got me covered there, though, because he drives cities like a pro, and he's, frankly, like, 30 minutes away roughly from Detroit so he doesn't mind usually hauling the last leg of the journey for me and Ryan but you were there just about a month ago again weather permitting I don't see the weather turning real bad soon but I know the farmers on the neck said something about uh it's gonna be really cold and a lot of precipitation so but um Brock I will assume unless you uh holler at me you want DK in here normal easy hard uh should I go hard? Well, I'll go hard mode with the player characters. I'll keep that rule. Fuck the farmers all Mac. They say that shit all the time. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It's just anytime time we hear snow's coming, it's like, <laughs> I know it's inevitable, but I wished I had a four-wheel vehicle in time. But anyway, uh, anybody else out there lurking in chat, if you want to pick a character to watch and play vicariously through, <laughs> uh, go ahead and shout out now. I'll give you all about a minute. If you don't shout up, I'll just choose a couple that I think will be fun to have. Shinulu's here and wants Yoshi. Yoshi it is. Player character goes hard. All right, we got one more slot. I think I'm going to throw you-know-who in, because I know AM Mayhem will be toddling along here shortly. I figure there will always be like at least four to five decent-sized storms. Oh, yeah, Absolutely. But, I don't know, we got in the last couple of winters have been a little bit friendly to us. They've been cold, but we only got maybe one or two really deep all-at-once snows. Alright. Timer's up. I know AM's gonna want his Daisy in, so we'll throw Daisy in. Do I dare play against three hard characters? I guess. I suffer for my art for you, Chad. <laughs> All right. Thoughts on the Mario movie trailer. Okay. So that's a good thing. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do this real quick. Before we start, let's open up. We're going to watch that trailer. I actually kind of wanted to do this anyways. I'm glad you reminded me, Brack. So you. And you. I'm going to pause emulation here. And we're gonna watch it. I don't watch trailer that can ruin plot points muted and hidden. <laughs> the deep Mario lore that you're about to witness here. I don't normally watch trailers, but I did this one because I wanted to see if it was gonna be totally dog crap or not. Because yeah, it could easily go that way. But um, I was, I'll, I'll save the reservations till after. All right. The trailer itself is beautiful, Brock says. All right. Like I said, I, I'm right there usually with Yoshinu. I don't like trailers to either, but in this case, I made an exception. All right. Um, sorry. Green. Boom. There we go. We can turn the cube off for one second. Okay, here we go. Let's take a peek ski at this. The king of the Koopas! 
gates! Attack! Of course, that's what you think it is. <laughs> Is but a taste of our fury. Do you yield? <laughs> I do not. Jack Black I nails finally both. found it. Now who's gonna stop me? Yeah. <laughs> All right, all right, listen here. Tell me. <sighs> Hold on, I, I gotta wait for it. I don't watch the show that much myself, but I wanna get into what it. What is this place? Do not touch that mushroom, you'll die! Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> that one's perfectly fine. Come on, Mario! All right, so quick pause. Now tell me this doesn't sound like Linda Belcher from Bob's Burgers. Mushroom Kingdom, here we come. <laughs> oh my god, it gets me every time I hear it. It gets me. <laughs> I don't even watch the show that much. In this, this is just fucking... I wish they gave Charlie more of a speaking, not just two screens. <laughs> so anyways, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Super Mario movie. Uh, like, let me get my screens back up real quick. Because I get tunnel vision, main screen off. All right. But anyways, look how awesome that CG looks. Yeah, Chris Pratt's voice is the only thing I'm like, ooh, about. Um, Jack Black nails Bowser. I absolutely agree about Jack Black. Um, If you put Jack Black in something and you need him to be intense, you got your man. Like, the dude puts like a... 200% of himself in everything he does. I think Bowser's going to steal the show. Um, Mario with Chris Pratt. Now, we only got two lines, and they were kind of, but I'm willing to give the guy a chance. I'm just hoping, and, you know, people have said there's a touch of it in there, but I don't hear it. I just kind of hope he hams it up a little bit with, like, the Boston accent that the Super Mario Brothers Super Show, you know, had. You know, rest in peace, Captain Lou Albano, but... Um, I, I really think that'd be cool if they went back to that for the movie, but I'm kind of like, I, I'm willing to give the dude a chance. It could sound great. It's two lines and they're not even done making the movie. Who knows? They might even read speak those lines. I just can't not hear Linda Belcher though. when he's like, mushroom kingdom, here we come. Like, <laughs> I don't even want to show that much. I'm like, oh my God, that sounds so familiar. But, uh. Hard to judge in a couple sentences, but we'll see. Yeah, um, I, I like the direction that they're going with it, that they're going like goofy with it, but still trying to tell a story at the same time. Um, I know a lot of people like, ooh, Grim Dark Mario deep lore, like it's freaking Mario, come on. But um, that being said, I know a lot of people are rooting for like Charles Martinet and want him to do the voice, and I can see that too. I just don't know if the Yahoo Whoopee voice would be a you know something to sit through through hour and a half two hour long movie but dude is a voice actor he could adapt it and change it and tone it down a little bit while still sounding like mario i think but um kind of don't know why they didn't cast him for that i know they casted him as a secret role which i'm still holding out that it's gonna be wario or wario and or waluigi like post credits for you know maybe a sequel reveal or something but but um animation looks great the style looks on point the only thing that kind of weirds me out is the spacing of Mario and Luigi's eyes. It seems like there's a lot more forehead and they're a little bit closer and maybe even slightly smaller, but I'm nitpicking. It still looks great. I'll get over it. <laughs> um, the Koopas look awesome. Toad looks sounds awesome. The penguin thing was funny. Uh, what else is there? Like, I don't know. I'm just looking forward to it. I hope it's a lighthearted, stupid romp. Like, it's kind of promising it is. Um, a Miyamoto won't... I don't think he'll let this go too far off the rails. Nintendo's just fiercely protective of everything they do, so I really don't see them doing anything too upsetting. Like I said, with the Chris Pratt thing, I, I just, I kind of think we just gotta give them a chance. I know not a lot of people are on the board the Chris Pratt train, but I don't dislike them, so, but. Anyway, um, let's see, what kind of map do we want to play? 
Uh, we did the Haunted Bash. We've not done the Soiree. Um, Midway Madness, I don't think we've done. We've done dun Jungle Jam. So, let's stay out of Jungle Jam in the Booze Haunted Bash. Let's try to do all these maps at least once. Uh, we got Goomba's Greedy Gala, or Gala, or however you want to say that. Toad's Midway Madness, or Koopa's Seaside Soiree. Um, I guess I'm just going to say whoever wants to shout out a map first. I'll go ahead and roll with that. I'm not familiar with Bob's Burger, so I'll have to check it out. He did the French version of the voice. Oh, nice. Of the voiceover. I didn't know he did the whole French version. I think it's going to be huge. Yeah, I think it's going to take off like Sonic did, maybe even bigger. Um, Sonic did really well. Like, it's an alternate universe than the one we're used to or whatever, but, like, that's how you get new people in, and that's how you keep the property from getting stale. You gotta kind of reinvent it every now and again. And I think Sonic proved that you can do a good video game movie. Um, I'll admit, the second one I really loved, but I kind of felt the human side stuff could have been trimmed, because that felt like it was its own sitcom instead of, like, part of this overall story involving a fox, a hedgehog, and a kid nun, like, a psycho robotics dude. <laughs> But, uh, Koopa Seaside. Alright, we'll do Koopa Seaside. Um, I wish they were releasing Mario Odyssey 2 alongside the movie or something. You know, never say never. They, they might, a few months later, announce it or something. Like, you know how Nintendo is. They don't let anything leak until they're, like, two months out from releasing it, so. Alright, 20 turns. Oh, I forgot. We can do teams. What do you know? We'll do free for out. Whoa, tweaking. I'm hitting down. Stop. Okay, sure. Oh, that's why. That wants me to confirm. Um, we'll do... Not 50. That's going to be way too long. We'll do 35. That's a solid few hours. All my games. Bonus is that. No handicap. Yes. I don't know. I think something Mario will be announced. It might even be at the movies, too. Like, oh, you know, like at the end of the credits or something. There's a big shocker drop. <laughs> but who knows? This is kind of all unprecedented for Nintendo, I feel like. So we could almost just kind of expect anything to happen. Although I do expect a sequel's probably already in the works. <laughs> or at least going to be. Because you're right. This is going to be big. I mean, even if it doesn't resonate with existing Nintendo fans that much, which it will... It's such a safe property. There's so many people that'll defend it, even if it ends up sucking. I mean, look at the original Super Mario movie from, like, the 80s. Like, that's a legitimately bad movie, but it's so bad that it has fans. And I'll admit, to an extent, I'm kind of one of them. I don't loud it as a good movie. I haven't watched it in over a decade. It's not like, I, oh, I must watch it every year. But it's so bad, it's campy. And it's, like, not totally unenjoyable, but... I saw it as coming in December. Wait. And really, movie doesn't come out in April, so you're right. Something could definitely get announced. I thought it was coming in December. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah, no, it's not that soon. It's still a ways away. Like I said, never say never. Nintendo could pull out and be like, ooh, look at the Super Mario movie video game movie game movie. <laughs> like, it's kind of flip-flopping video game to movie, but I'm sure they'll make a video game adaption of it, so, of the story. I'm convinced that the higher-ups in Nintendo hold their employees' family at gunpoint during the development of their games because nothing leaks. Yeah, <laughs> you know, uh, over there in Japan where they make their manga artists sleep on site in order to be able to produce more and faster. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't be surprised if they just, all right, everybody, you're moving into the Mario compound. Nobody's getting out until, you know, four years down the road when we're done with this. <laughs> Sign the agreement <laughs> and you're Mario's now. <laughs> Alright, uh, enjoy the back atmosphere as you mellow out my early groove and bask in the sights. Now shall we decide the order? Ugh. Oh my god! Oh fucking course! It's gonna, it's gonna go like that, chat. This is how our evening is set up. Of course, Donkey Kong's first. I'm dead last. 1837. That was a good year. Truly appreciate the island, you have to have money. <laughs> it's like anywhere else, really? Uh, well, any vacation spot, I guess. 
Here's a star. 20 coins. Oh, it's right behind the board. Start spot. All right. So begins another night of, as AM Mayhem would put it, me whining. <laughs> hey, I get the grade. That's the whole point of Mario Party, right? I don't have any friends and friendships over this game with, so I gotta gripe at the computer instead. <laughs> there he is, lucky number seven, Daisy. <laughs> Woo! I heard that. Well, thank you, Bractimus, for the gift sub. You've reached tip tri tipple, triple digits on the gifts. Congratulations, Brock. 100 triple. You get all of them. You get all of them. All right, hold on, hold on. You get this one in particular. Four ninety nine a case. Looks like they brought the good stuff. Thank you, buddy, for all the gift subs, and you also, uh, man, you, you resub tonight yourself. Holy smokes! <laughs> awesome. Aaron is number one hundred. Oh shit. <laughs> Well, lucky day, Aaron. I decided that you'd be along pretty shortly when we were choosing characters. So I decided, what the hell? Daisy's on the board. Okay. Balance and everything, I guess. Roll one, get a ten. Okay. Hey, don't screw around. You screw around too much. Screw it around, goddammit. <laughs> what can I buy this early? Make any other player mega or me? Uh, remember, you'll bypass all board events. Only one to five. And Mega. Oh, Mega! Is it too late to ask for my $500 back? <laughs> well, you know, petition Twitch and <laughs> see uh, if they'll let go. I got another Mega Mushroom. Kick ass. Sheesh. Well, your investment has been put to good use, Brock, because I've been getting better cameras and microphones and stuff, so I'm reinvesting it back into the stream and then some, so. <laughs> I only put, you know, a few thousand dollars down on a new machine for you guys, which you helped me build. <laughs> oh, boys are in the back. There we go. <laughs> Let's get to work. All right. Oh, by the way, I don't know. I half-ass field test it, but I think I got vibration working with this, so if we get that one mini game, which we probably will, um, where I'm climbing the side of the mountain and I have to judge by the vibration when to stop, I might be able to do it this time. Alright, the race goes on. Uh, step of the gas and the light turns green. Uh, next. Sorry, change gears. Meter starts blinking, it's time to shift gears. Alright, do it. Practice is for the week. I need practice! Good way to stir it. Time to cancel the country club membership, Tad. <laughs> Mario Speedwagon. I can't fight this feeling anymore. <laughs> oh, Miner. I still call you Miner, even though you got your screen name sitting right there for me. Hold on. There we go. You had to get it. Now it's time for me to fly. <laughs> Uh, all right. Okay, I may have gotten last, but hey, look at that. That 10 kind of even things out. I got two Mega Mushrooms, too. Although, it's like you don't want to go and gun for the star right off the bat, because then you're the target for everybody's rage the rest of the game. <laughs> Human or computer. Everybody's getting more pipes, it's making me worry a little bit. <laughs> Mega mushrooms for everybody. Yeah, I'm in no rush quite yet. I don't want to use a mega mushroom yet. 
like I said, if you get that first star, then you just start getting trapped and crap all the time from everybody else. Rage? Oh, that reminds me. I'll have to see if the pick turned out. Like, for werewolf or something? Help your teammate to clear all the obstacles in this dank dungeon. Move, jump, move a lever. Oh, this one. I hate this. Oh, lordy, lordy. I hate this one. All right. Uh. Go, me, go. God, I hate this one. Go, man, go! Alright, this is the part I hate coming on. <laughs> watch the shadow, watch the shadow. Oh my god, see? Ah, I hit the jump button and I still slid off like a chump. Yeah, we've already bombed this one, they got it. It helps when you're a computer and you can just target where you need to go. Okay, that works. <laughs> They still got it. There it is. Finish. Team Chode! I don't know if you saw it or not, but gotta work Nag Nag has hit gold, so it's 100% coming out on 11.9. Awesome! There's a variation of this game on Superstars. Yeah, I think they dumped that one down a little bit. I'm not 100% sure, but. Ah, uh, it's that jumping over. The thing, uh, the Kerjigger there, the rotating platform, that gets me. Oh, thank you for the assist, Midas Ma. Bork, bork. <laughs> oh, wee little baby. Baby mushroom. Tropical music going on. Uh oh, Yosha's looking to throw some shade here. I can do that back. I can do that back. Oh my god, that's a oh my god, that's a lot of spaces. Oh, that's a lot of money. Oh, I remember this. This is bullshit. It's random if you go up or down. I like this convoluted thing they make just for a random D2 roll. It's a monkey and he throws a banana peel and you have to slip on it. And... Oh shit. Okay, as I say, he just kind of screwed himself a little bit there. He was on his way to the star. <laughs> but yeah, and he had the money to do it. All right, well, there's no way I'm catching his ass, so. Definitely not. That's okay. We are in the character building phase of our campaign here. We do not need to go for the boss dungeon tr uh, loot yet. Discord for the pick. All right. Let me check this out real quick. Oh, is Discord going to do that thing now? Yeah, it's going to do the thing. All right, I'll have to check it out later. Discord's doing that fucking famous thing it does where you click on it and it doesn't load, and it doesn't load, and it doesn't load. And you have to cold... Yeah, you have to cold kill the program and reload it. And... 
Yeah, I got it. Here, you know what? I got it on this laptop. Ah! Got around your bullshit, Discord. Uh, ooh. Oh, I think we've played this one before. Oh, that's the D and D Discord. Oh my God. Load slower. <laughs> it loaded at an old Mario Party clip line <laughs> where uh, Yoshi's itchy butthole. Oh yeah, <laughs> trumpet. Nice. Let me open original here so I can actually look at it bigger. PSD line Oh, the IK, the Black Spiral Dance. Okay, that's scary. <laughs> the Black Spiral Dancer truck. Very nice AM. <laughs> that's almost as scary as the JB Hunt ones. I don't know why they're hunting me, but. <laughs> uh, I'm glad you said only Jared will get it because I'm like, what is BSD? Yeah, so Black Spiral Dancers and Werewolf the Apocalypse are basically the evil, corrupted tribe of werewolves that are just all perverted and evil and corrupt. And <laughs> long story short, I could go on for all six hours of the stream about it, but I'll spare all of you. Your player's control robots, the other player runs um, 45 seconds. So we gotta kill DK. Change direction forward and back. Okay. I hope we can do it. 45 seconds is an eternity in these things. The uh, tank controls. <laughs> He's got nowhere to go. I've got top and bottom covered. Yeah, see, forty five seconds. And the hard computer couldn't last 10. <laughs> Glad I wasn't the singled out one on that. Woo. Hey. I'm so sorry, but the cabana is closed. You're a loser. Get me, get me, please get me. <laughs> DK's still funny too, because he's only two, three squares away. What you drinking here, Mike's? Yeah, harder lemonade. The good stuff. The cabana is cabanaed. You know me, I like my sugary alcohol. It's just a one or a two on the roll. Yet we have to have this monkey get sloppy with his banana peel. They all get right there. <laughs> Why are they soaking watermelons anyways? <laughs> You need to hit up St. John's Brewing with Broctimus Prime. I'm always down for a good brewery. That's not even that far away, really. Especially so for him. Alright, view map. Z. This one. I have eight. One, two, four. Oh, wait, no, that's down. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh, that could end in a Bowser. Or seventy. Now let's head right. Fuck it. Yeah, yeah. Take my money, punk. Haven't been there and not sure how the beer is. The food menu looks good though. I can, bro. Yeah, I'll be down sometime. Ah, you. Woo! Three biggins! I just can't use it next turn, because I think I'll skip the star if I do. 
But yeah, I'll be down. Um, maybe they have good steaks or something, or wings, or even. I know you're a wing nut. <laughs> Oh, this one's we've done before. Uh, controls. Move, open a box. Simple enough. Star. Oh shit, I forgot they cover them up. I only remembered one. Burger. Ah, that's the one I needed! <laughs> wow, I remembered the Oh shoot, Yoshi didn't get the. <laughs> I almost blew it by standing there like a turd. Corn dog burger fries. <laughs> this one? No. Fuck. I didn't know where the other one was at. Or dog shape. I got cheat. Thanks How the fuck? I didn't even get to see what he wanted. Well, that's fucking cheating, if you ask me. No, I even remember shit. I guess it don't matter if the computer's just gonna auto get this shit. Whatever. Whatever. Fuck me in the ass. The fucking dialogue box didn't even pop open on number two. Eesh. Use your aggressive feeling. Damn right. Boy. Let the hate flow through you. <laughs> well, I'm gonna cheat next time and pause the emulation. How's that, fucking CPU? Mm. Oh god, somebody's regretting some decisions here. It's burgers and fries, not wine. Excuse me, it's burgers and fries, not hacks. Fucking cheater days. <laughs> Red wine soon. <laughs> Waste of an item. Yeah, it would have landed on the cabana either way. <laughs> oh shit! Ah. Yoshi Stain destroyed the place. Alright. Now the trouble is, I can't use a big one. Cause I'll just bypass the star, so one, two, three. We need a four or better. Do it! Or a one, what the f ever. <laughs> I guess, as long as it's not on the dolphin. Alright, so now as long as it's not a one or a two next time. The long claw of the law. <laughs> Jon Snow's sword of the law. Catch character shown in the winner poster three times to win. Rotate right. Oh shit. Okay. <sighs> Move up and down and catch character. Okay. <sighs> I'm not gonna say I'm gonna do good at this either, but go. <laughs> Didn't you see the hack browns? Oh shit, that was a move. Okay, that's okay, that's okay, that's okay. Right here. Oh shit! Yes! Winrar! Woo! DK was sniping, I think. The Hex Browns. <laughs> I think DK was lined up to snag his, his last one <laughs> as soon as I got mine. Down to the wire. We're sorry, but Yoshi partied too hard and destroyed the building. You have to come back next time. Big oof. <laughs> I 
You're blacklisted, Yoshi. You can't stay here. Oh. Alright. Better than a two. Alright, that'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Go, Ouija. Now I just painted a goddamn target on my back. <laughs> You know I me, mean? not a fan of potatoes, but hash browns are good. It is a potato. Oh, I don't get it. There's just so many things you can do with potatoes. Like fries and stuff. And, uh, not even, I'm just thinking light there. What are we doing? Oh, a dolphin. <laughs> you boil mash them, yeah. Potatoes. Boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. Boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. Boil em, mash em, boil em, mash em. Gotta love it. Oh shit, Team Green! Check out the Lucky Mini Game. I'll give the wheel a spin a roo and we'll see what's in store. Stars are on the. Whoa, hold on. Oh! Twice the number of coins. I thought it was gonna give two stars away. I'm like, what? <laughs> what? Game changer right off the bat. Okay. That's still pretty good, but still. Right or left. Oh, yeah, shit. Maybe the first pilot, the dory boat out of the cave. Ah, uh, yeah, this one sucks too. Uh, forward. Right or left or. Alright, so I gotta hold the controller upside down pretty much. <laughs> Because the buttons on this controller are the opposite of what a GameCube was. So if I want to be paddling correctly, I gotta hold it upside down. Oh, rewiring my brain too hard. We bit it too. Go, man, go. Shit, 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 shit. This is harder than it looks, you guys. Yeah, I know, that's what she said. Just tell me to slow down! Yeah, shit. I suck at that one. That's just hard to navigate. That's what she said. There you go. You can't. That's what she said. Your own words. I sure can. I just did. <laughs> all right. All right. <laughs> oh, that Midas bot's gonna get some mileage out of that. I think. <laughs> all right. So small. It's a teeny weeny little monkey. <laughs> this Koopa's hustling a tiny monkey for money to build his cabana so others can party hard. Big Ten. Yay! I'm so thrilled. Now I'm gonna hustle you because you tore the place down. You sick, sadistic son of a bitch. <laughs> Hop on my back and let's ride. <laughs> Watch the blowhole. Alright. Fuck it, let's do it. Um, item. Yeah. Stomp the shit out of this ape. Suck my toes. Boom. <laughs> I'm gonna still get a two. Uh, ish I got a teeny weeny monkey for you. Wait a minute. <laughs> gonna get on a slippery banana now. <laughs> 
Just to please the damn monkey, that's all it is. Ooh. Don't watch me get that right back. Options. Options are good. <laughs> Oh, okay. This one's a lot more profitable for the single person up top, methinks. Dot. Shoot! Me! Hit! Hit! Shoot! Money bag! Okay. Maybe it's more profitable for us because he's missing quite a lot there. Oh shit! I say and I immediately get reprimanded for it. Cool. See, nobody really loses in that. You just get what you get. Somebody. Oh, my dog. I'm a big old dog. <laughs> Chimpanzee screen gets me too. What's up, buddy? What's up, Donald? See, there he is, upside down. <laughs> hey, good boy. Aw, check him out, everybody. <laughs> what does spine mean? Uh oh. Yeah, you're gonna get this the dirty way, ain't ya? Here we go. Luigi loses star. Oh yeah, DK gets star from Luigi. Oh, that wasn't pre-programmed in or anything at all. Oh, Daisy, okay. Sweet, I'll stop my bitching. <laughs> Look at the little posy! Oh, shit! They didn't have any stars, so they're just swapping money. Trade delicious. All stars and coins. That really wasn't as big of a deal as it should have been. <laughs> Wow, that sucks. That was just like a 10 coin difference or something like that. Now that's where it's devastating endgame. Or, conversely, <laughs> miracle, I guess. Oh shit. Oh shit. Whoever uh, parties at the cabana next is gonna really uh, <laughs> be paying up. So I am going to make some new emotes eventually here soon. I've been kind of thinking about it. Not to replace any of them, but I do have a few open slots. Some time ago, Twitch gave affiliates, probably partners too, um, five follower slots. And I basically just dropped most of the emotes that I have down to the follower. You know, so anybody who follows can use them. But um, the subscription tier stuff, I'm, uh, I got a few open slots. I'm just debating what gonna more or less probably be Midas. <laughs> I know I've been using Castle of the Winds as well for a few of them, but... I'll probably just go down the list of emojis and see what would be a, something fun and appropriate to make Midas do. Kind of like the blaster and yeah, the glasses and laughing like Brock used. <laughs> Let's see, what's ahead of us? You map. Uh, it's Cabana Chat, and I think I kind of just want to bypass that. Poor boy, dance for me. Dick 
Dixie Wetsworth. Something like that. <laughs> Turn oh my god, are you fucking joking? Wow, this sucks, guys. Oh wait, no, it's a blue square, isn't it? Yes, okay. It sucks a little less. I got a little extra coinage out of it, I guess, whatever. I thought it was gonna literally put me on the damn square I was trying to avoid, which was three deep. I didn't really want to pay that fee for the cabana. But okay, whatever. Less sucky option. Okay, cool. Um, jump and change direction. This one's easy enough. Invis 24 power up. Dead Ringa! Power up. Welcome in, buddy. Thank you for the sub. How are you doing? Appreciate it, man. Must erase DK. <laughs> Thank you so much, Dead Ringa. Appreciate that sub, my friend. Hope your evening's going well. <laughs> Going well, how are you guys doing? Doing pretty good, my friend. I'm kind of streaming on an off night because of uh, work-related stuff, but I'm having a fun time with some chums playing some Mario Party. Having fun with an asterisk for now. <laughs> Just because I'm in first. <laughs> How far are we even in? Nine out of three? Nine already? Holy smokes. Yeah, just slap five more rounds on there. This is going back kind of quick. That's okay, though. Um, We're going to play some stuff after this. I kind of got a family feud on the mine. We haven't played that in a minute, and I feel like if I'm going to get properly dicked in Mario Party, I might as well get properly dicked by Lucky McCoy. Then who knows after that? We'll do another board game or something or maybe I'll just fall back on some poker because I love playing poker and I hope that's all entertaining enough for y'all. Oh no! Ah, you guys are the best though. I still really appreciate that. I'll be home to carry you and Wheel of Fortune in an hour. <laughs> yeah, carry is absolutely right. Shanulu, you're like MVP at that game. You really ought to consider going for real season. Oh shit, another five coins. This Koopa's gonna get loaded, man. bit extra coinage. I'll take it. Hope your uh, work evening is going pretty smooth for you, Shanu. Glad to hear you're doing good, Pedringa. Pop or pop? Buy a man a drink first. Jesus. <laughs> Alright, one player gets a, <laughs> get a spiky ball and tries to pop the other balloons to the other three. Any of three targets survive, all three win. Jump roll move, jump and change direction. And if a player with the balloons time the jumps just right, they can jump farther. Alright, so just jump and change direction. Alright, here goes nothing. Oh god! Oh god! Oh, yeah, come after me first, whatever. Get away from me, bitch. Stop targeting me! <laughs> Alright, it's good for half a second there. Never gonna catch me! Never gonna catch me! 
continue next year. Oh shit. BK, you better not ball block me here. Luigi's already busting blue balls over here. Damn, go catch me! Beer me! Yeet! Smells like my mama's cooking. Yeah, boy. Thank you, Brock. Holy shit. Is this gonna upgrade again or is it just gonna smash whoever actually stays in it next? It's gonna be me, isn't it? No, I'm. I'm okay. You map real quick. No strategic maneuver. Okay, smash it. Smash that like button! the morning, Jack Septi guy. <laughs> he always says that smash the like button. <laughs> hmm. I wonder how he's doing nowadays. I actually regrettably haven't watched any of his stuff lately, but Alright, please finish the photo puzzle. You can only drop a piece of the proper place so you know when you found the correct spot. Alright. Rotate a piece, move a piece, drop a piece. A piece? Like a piece? Or <laughs> Right, rotate, move, drop. Focus on the picture. You remember the way the piece fits. All right. How good are my spatial skills here? Besides, not very. Gun. Oh, we were all in the same spot. Woo! <laughs> you get that in the back! Ah! AM knows what I'm talking about. Grand Theft Auto 3. Once in a grand while when you... <laughs> yeah, exactly. Once in a grand while when you rob a cabbie, it would have the cabbie, he'd say, like, get in the... He'd be like, get that in the back! Ah! Because <laughs> he's screaming as you're pulling him out the door. Uh, old, old run. Oh, DK, he's gonna get it! 25 coins! No, just like that! I don't know, maybe don't build your cabana in a flood zone, dude? Changing the star? I don't even remember really where it was at, so I guess whatever. Not anywhere near me, anyway. Fimo Balamo? <laughs> Wait. I don't think that's near me. I think it put it right before Yoshi. <laughs> Monkey gets his jollies by tripping people. Oof! Y'all playing D and D Saturday? This Saturday we won't be. Um, we're going to well, not all of us, but most, you know, a few of us anyway. Um, going to a Halloween party down at the Avenue Bar. Oh no, right in front of Yoshi, not behind him. Okay. Well, that's okay right now because it doesn't make me the sole target anymore. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to the Avenue Bar. They're having their giant like dark arts Halloween weekend, and uh, John and I went to that last year. Um, that's kind of how I. Th I think I introduced John to the bar last year was taking him to the Halloween party there. 
but we had such a good time, like, we, like, last year said, oh yeah, we're definitely coming back, like, <laughs> um, the following couple weekends, I don't think we'll be playing, but I do want to do, <laughs> this is kind of a special announcement in the making, I guess I'll just drop it right now, but, um, I would like to do, I may have already said, I don't know, but anyways, I'd like to do, uh, Mansions of Madness, we have a, uh, yeah, I did mention on, I think, in the D&D stream. There's a, one particular mission we haven't played for years, because it's like, it says it's like a six hour long game, and you have to like, this is one of the few ones where you actually like want to write down your clues and stuff. Normally they give them so that you can just look at them in game and judge what you need to do, but um, Mansions of Madness is an HP Lovecraft board slash video game. <laughs> It's kind of a hybrid. It was a board game, strictly, but it was one that the guys told me, like, first edition, it literally take, like, an hour to set up, and then you could play, and then, like, an hour clean up. Well, since then, some time ago, they made a, a companion app for your computer, you know, program or whatever, and a lot of the clerical stuff is taken care of by the app, so you can set your board up, move your pieces around, the puzzles are all on the screen, so you just do the puzzles instead of like manually, okay, look up, okay, this does this and this and that, da, 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 da. Um, it's a really fun game, we've been playing it a lot, um, I know a few of you here even have played it, um, but there's, like I said, that one real big mission we keep putting off because it's like, well, do we really want to play six hours of it, but now we're going to make a purpose and I want to stream it for everybody. Um, I don't know... It probably won't be the following weekend, which is like the 22nd or something, and then the 29th, that might be that weekend, I really don't know, I'm trying to count way far ahead, so I just, I gotta talk to the guys and see who's available what weekend. Either way, we won't be doing D&D for a little few weeks just because uh, one week the DM is gone after the party, and then the following week AM Mayhem has got another wedding, <laughs> so we probably won't meet then either because um, we're trying to play when we all can get together because this is kind of a crucial story for a few of us and to have any of us missing kind of i don't know uh it's just not generic stuff that we've been doing so uh jump and shoot not that any of what we do is super generic or anything but oh, wait jump and shoot jump shoot okay mill baskets are two points by almost one you have to high point and jump to make it to the middle row we'll seeing if you need to bring up a board game or two hope you all have fun oh yeah um, we will do a board game night pretty soon here. I'm sure we'll have another weekend coming up. But, um, like I said, I just, I've been trying to get out of the house more often because, like, just being alone all day, every day, has just kind of got, gotten to me and I try to get out when I can, so. Like I said, it's nice to a point, but when the old introvert battery's charged up, it just gets lonely from that point on, so I try to get out. Even if it's just to sit and people watch. But, um, I do want to have a board game night again soon just because we haven't had one in a minute, so. It's just it's October and I like to get my spooky on, so, um, and then I'm going to a Red Wings game in November too, one weekend. Um, me, my buddy Tom and Ryan are all gonna get together and do our annual thing, which Tom spoiled me on hockey with the sweet life, <laughs> the sweet tickets that we had last year, so we're gonna try to do that again. Alright, let's play some b-ball in the meantime. But yeah, I would like to do the Mansions of Madness thing for sure. Oh, okay. Give me all the fucking green hoops again. <laughs> there we go. Money in the bank for Luigi! <laughs> Woo! Man, Daisy and DK had a real bad time. Of course, they were in the middle, though. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, the middle's tough. Those sweet tickets were sweet. <laughs> Hold on, hold on, I have to do something. There. <laughs> no, it really was. That's. Those were the tickets where we had like a little lobby, not to ourselves, but I'd, I'd say it was roughly 30 people, maybe, give or take. Um, maybe more, maybe less, but roughly around there. Um, we had our own like lobby separate from the general public and 
We had unlimited food, unlimited basic beers. They encourage you to double fist and just get sloppy wasted. <laughs> Um, and then when you walked out to your seats, it was just a simple walk out, turn left to right, and you're right in your, wherever your ticket would be. We were only about like 15, 20 rows up in dead center ice. Um, you definitely pay for the difference in the ticket and the food and the alcohol. Because what, like a tall boy at a freaking ball game or a hockey game anymore is like 12 bucks or something? Pardon my French, but... <laughs> but yeah, like even after a couple drinks, you probably paid for your ticket. It'd be hard to go back to regular seats after experiencing it. Oh, absolutely. He spoiled it for me. It's like, oh, I don't want to do it anymore. No, I'd still go, but <laughs> it's definitely a game changer. Ah, the star's right there, too. Me and the donkey of Kongs. Cheap, cheap, sweep. Is this the one I think it is with the nets in the pool? Yes, it is. Uh, red and yellow. Move, catch, empty. Okay. <laughs> I can't go back to sitting with the peasants. I can't. I won't. Near any of these sons of bitches. How are they catching any? Steer them away from you. There, fuck you guys. I can't get them, nobody can. Fuck you guys, fuck you guys. You ain't getting any more. Fuck all y'all. <laughs> you ain't getting any. Piss off, wanker. Aw, oh, come on. I'm not even trying anymore. Fuck this. This game sucks. No, piss off, piss off, you ain't getting the gold one. Sorry, Daisy, I'm a shitty partner. Fuck you, Yoshi. Beat you over the head. Oh, no, I can't catch a single fucking fish in this game. I don't know what the secret is. But yeah, those sweet tickets are... Hell, the seed alone was worth it. Even if you didn't have the free food and the free alcohol, you just have the lobby and the seats, like, I'd still pay that. <laughs> it's really nice because LCA is still practically brand new. All the modern amenities. This is coming from seeing games at Joe Louis Arena, which were memorable, don't get me wrong. I love Joe Louis too, but there's definitely a lot of things that that place had that were a little bit of a headache that LCE just pretty much took care of. I will say I got the uh, privilege of having a, what would you call it, kind of like a sweet ticket there too, except those, would you call it a booth? Probably a booth. Uh, we went and see, saw a booth game. Ryan actually got these tickets, not Tom, but um, Ryan got us tickets to a booth at Joe Louis Arena, and that was more or less the same thing, except it was a lot more private. It was only like maybe a dozen people. And then um, you also had the food. Um, you still had to buy your beers, but there was still basic like pizza and chicken wings that you could get uh, in the little area. Hot dogs, hamburgers, stuff like that. But the neat part about that one is instead of your seats being up close, the booths were all basically hanging over the ice almost. Not directly over, but they were way up high and you could just kind of look down and see everything going on. It was pretty cool. Not as cool as these newer ones, I'll say. I'll admit that, but... Walk the narrow path without falling. Oh, okay. This one. Boom, 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 boom. Craw! Whoa. Ah, shit. Oh, man, go. Whew. Get all sweaty on that one. <laughs>
time to cancel the country club membership, Tad. Golden shower. Mm. <laughs> That's a pretty penny. Wahoo! <laughs> that sucks. It's gonna suck when I don't get it either. Cause that's how many away. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I gotta get eight or better. <laughs> ah! If the rings are swimming in the ocean, each ring is worth one. Enemy hit you, you lose points. Press the play to the lead and forward. Gold are worth three. Alright. Swimming in a dress. Wunba. Oh god, controls aren't inverted. Okay. I was like, how did I just breeze by that? Your shame, Daisy. <laughs> Woo! I'm the best. I'm a de Everybody else drowns. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, moth. Be gone, moth. Ah. Slapped it. Made it good. It flew off. It hit the ground and then went back up, but whatever. Them bugs. Yeah. Oh, she gambling. I'm sorry, you lost. Wait, this can't happen to me. I'm rich. You got drugs. Ah! You don't have enough! Hunk! Do I have enough money? Well, here's your star. <laughs> Clear over in BFE. Oh shit, I'm gonna pay the toll. Troll toll! Um, I guess let's go this way. Pay the troll toll anyway. <laughs> oh no! Well, I want my money back. I didn't get to actually stay there. What kind of operation are you running? Insurance fraud? 
Dream Treasure Track. Oh, I hate this one too. <laughs> I'm not the swellest at these either, but display hide man. Didn't even know you could do that. Uh, left is red, right is blue. So I do gotta pick up the red ones. Ah! Shh. Of course. Ah! Daisy! I'm coming, I swear, I'm coming! <laughs> we got it, 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 we got it. All right. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> TK squatting back there, taking a hot one. Yeah, well, that's what I think of this. Hold on. Why am I going raspberry when I can just go like that? <laughs> Fart noises. Premium Twitch quality content right there. <laughs> Daisy Smash. Next week, we'll be starting another new game. I think I'm going to scrap my original plans, just because I kind of ran out of time. <laughs> I was thinking of playing God of War, like the remake or whatever, and then leading up to God of War Ragnarok release, but I think I'm going to scrap that. I think I'm going to just play Ragnarok on my own, in my own free time, so I can enjoy it at my own pace. Because I just didn't have enough time to squeeze both in, and I thought about, well, okay, I'll just play Ragnarok then. And I still might, like, release day or something, but... But I think as far as playing through the whole thing, I'm just gonna kind of take my own time so I can just sit here and my, let my eyes glaze over and absorb what I need to out of it. But, um... I might... I'm kicking around. There's one more game I kind of wanted to squeak in, and then we're gonna do the long play that I've had planned out since the beginning of summer. Um, I'm definitely coming down to that. Um, for the long play, I want to do the original Final Fantasy VII. I'm debating if uh, I want to use mods or not to make it look shinier. I probably will. Just to upgrade the graphics a little bit, make them look a little less chunky. But um, that's the long play I got lined up. But there is kind of one more game I kind of wanted to play before really getting into that. Um, the game before that would probably only take... I don't know. I'm guessing roughly around five streams worth or so, if even that. That's kind of a long play in itself. We'll see. It's an old Game Boy game. I don't want to reveal anything quite yet, just in case I change my mind, but I'm kind of 50-50. Do I want to squeak this game in for a few weeks first, or do I just want to go to the long play? Because we're already getting to be half... Excuse me, God. We're almost halfway through October already, and I kind of wanted to start it when the weather was getting cold. And lo and behold, aside from today, it's been getting cold. Again, I'm thinking too far ahead. I, I tend to do this, overthink everything I do, so. Um, and you get two dice, but then you roll one of five. Use this to become mega. Then you will roll three dice at a fun time. Uh, yeah. Super sprint. Isn't that insane? We're already almost halfway through October? It is! I don't want to get older! Okay. 
kidding. It'll be the end of the year in 2023 before we know it. But yeah, as far as the next game, we'll see. Oh, perfect amount. See, I'm set up real nice and pretty now, but wait until we get that reversal of fortune or whatever it was. And I have to trade everything away to the last place player. Mm. Bug. No. Got him. Got him. Oh, yeah. Monster Hunter. Suck it, Moth. Got you. Getting your dust all over my computer desk. Yeah, I can't believe it either. You already have three items, so nothing happened. Fish and drips. Yeah, it's an old Game Boy game. About a month or so ago, one of the people I follow on Twitter mentioned something about it, and I'm like, oh, that game existed, and I played it through, and I loved it, and oh, crap, I'm already playing something. <laughs> Fill the tank with enough water for the cheap cheap to swim. Okay. Press these buttons on order with it. Oh, good lord. Okay. Press the correct button on your turn. Oh, you know what? I'm not putting my party mode on, am I? Hold on. Let's see if I can handle this for that long, even. Hold on, hold on. This will show up better on the new camera, though. I think I did it once before and it didn't show up on the camera all that well. I mean, it showed up, but... You? You? Yeah, kind of. Kind of, not really. I feel like it'll just be more of a distraction than anything. It kind of shows up. I got a LED bulb here that I can control all the lighting. <laughs> I'll turn it off for now. It's fun, but I don't think you guys can really see it that much. You see it on my face a little bit, but anyway, uh, let's do it. Alright. Pay attention. Hardcore here. Shrugged it off three times. Our pet fish died because it had like not that much water to fill it. Oh, it's too shallow. <laughs> DK baby, whatever. <laughs> you trip on a banana peel, DK. <laughs> I like how they always charge themselves up like, this is going to hurt like hell, but here we go. <laughs> uh? Oops. Yoshi Smash! Close enough to set yourself up for the cabana. Very nice. Maybe. Alright, you map. What'd it do? I can use my tiny shroom. Shortcut. Or I'll go straight down. near that star am I it's a clear it up there okay so what we'll do use item use that tiny shroom just just a little bit of shroom just a little bit baby amount it's so small 
big American penis. Yeah. Secret path. Maybe that's a sound clip I need to get for you guys. Eh, hey, so small. You're even big, a mannequin penis. <laughs> I should. Somebody remind me in Discord later. I'll try to hunt that down and put it on your guys' soundboard to use. <clears throat> uh, press the switch, repeat it. Ooh, I'm good at this one. Okay, cool. This is like crank and yank AM. <laughs> Tap the switch. Oh, oh let's do it. <clears throat> All right, I'm not doing anything sus. Just uh, getting in position here. God, I was holding my breath for that one. Ooh, I need a cigar. Yoshi won! Holy shit! Wow, I didn't even get second by that far. God damn! That's rough, buddy. <laughs> I was even using my turbo twitch finger. <laughs> Holy fuck. <clears throat> Woo! Damn, what a ride. Music's catchy though. <laughs> and like my couple of big rolls. Oh no! That Bowser spot's been hot tonight. <laughs> Jack Black and Seth Rogen are gonna duke it out, you guys. Oh, it's just a Koopa kid, never mind. Not Jack Black, it's one of the kids from School of Rock. Step off! Well, what do you say when somebody's all up in your grill and you just want them to back down? Step off! <laughs> I love that movie. I recommend it if you guys haven't seen it. I'm pretty sure you all probably have gotten around to it by now. It's like a 2004 movie or something, but... School of Rock is definitely some of Jack Black's better work. Not that he has terrible work that I'm aware of, but I love Tenacious D and everything, too, so. <laughs> as bad of a movie Goosebumps kind of was, he still was still funny in it. Still was, still was. Classic, yeah. Nah, School of Rock was great. I think my favorite thing about that movie, besides from Jack Black hamming it up and having fun with the kids on screen or whatever, but is the fact that that movie didn't really have, like, a proper antagonist. I mean, it, it kind of was, you know, his roommate's girlfriend was being a bitch through it, and, you know, some of the parents were a little bit mad, but the antagonist, there was no real challenge other than just like, oh... Jack Black trips himself and gets himself into the situation and makes everybody feel good in the end. Like, cool. <laughs> the challenge was teaching the kids how to play music. I mean, maybe getting over the fact that, you know, he was faking the job, but... <laughs> Would you like to enter the boob house? Oh, oh, boo house. I got a fucking boo for you. I wanted the boob house, but whatever. Steel Star, let's do it. Um, I'm sorry, Daisy. You got the most money. You know what? No. I'm washing my hands of this. Now gaze deeply into my balls. I mean, my crystal balls. <laughs> Bitch. Hey, boo tease. <laughs> hey, um, I'm not the bitch. The randomizer is. There it is. Woo! I know. It was a tease. It was the boob house. 
The boo stole the star, all according to plan. <laughs> My hands are washed. I hit anybody. Now do come again. I'm just starting to enjoy this. The Koopa's a goddamn fucking... Uh, not a masochist. Uh, why am I brain farting on it? Whatever. Sadistic. A sadist. There we go. I'm like, I know this word. Why did my, Why is it not coming to mind? All right, uh, let's go. Sisma. Sisma. <laughs> Reverse a bomb. Okay, I, I remember this one. I think this was in Superstars as well. Boom, 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 boom. Whoop, 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 whoop. Off, Yoshi. <laughs> it's a buzzer. All right. I'm not terrible at that one. <laughs> Always. Knock on wood. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> God, I laugh at too many of my own stupid jokes. Alright, all y'all. We are approaching the two hour mark and I have to pee. So I will be right back in about five minutes. Refresh my drink, pet this dog, take a leak, all that good stuff. Don't go anywhere. We're just, I wouldn't say getting started, but we're still in the first half of this. So uh, I'll see y'all in five. BRB. <laughs>
All right, and I'm back. You got to get a load of this, though. Um, so one of the things I forgot to sort of mention in the beginning, but it's not a real big deal, I guess. Overwatch 2 launched <laughs> recently, uh, last week. And, uh, yeah, I don't think I need to say anything. Uh, it was a rough as hell. It still is launch. But they just posted something not too long ago. It's like, when Overwatch 2 launches, Bumpy, you make it up to the players. Besides making progress on bug fixes and stabilization... Which they have been working on, okay, whatever. This seems to happen with every Blizzard launch. It's just terrible. Like, they under-anticipate their popularity. But anyway, uh, you get a health pack weapon charm, which is, according to the, as far as I know, the first weapon charm of the game, which that is something they did, which I really like. They are adding charms and crap like that, which, whatever, it's cosmetic. I know, big deal, but it's fun stuff to collect while you're playing, like, I'd be playing anyway, so it's nice to have all these little extra things, but um, Curse Captain Reaper, a unique, or a legendary skin, which it's going to show up like ass here because it's a Twitter post, but yeah, I don't know. I'm I'm into the pirate thing. I'm dressing up as a pirate for our uh, Halloween party this weekend, so I could be down. I'm currently rocking the Rat King, but uh, I could be convinced. <laughs> and then that's the uh, weapon charm jigger there. But, um, yeah, yeah, okay, whatever. Two times experience points or something like that a couple of weekends. Whatever. I don't care, <laughs> I guess. Back. All right. But, um, might just look so cozy. Oh, yeah, he is. Scoot this down a little bit in case he moves forward. Thank you for the welcome back, by the way. Everything I've watched uh, and read on the monetization of Overwatch 2, it's awful. I have no intention of coming back, but that's me. Yeah, then don't buy stuff. Yeah. <laughs> No, I'm... I don't know. I, I, I miss not being able to play with you, Brock. I'll see. I'll put that out there right now. But overall, my experience with Overwatch 2 has been more positive than negative. It's largely... It's exactly what I said it was going to be from the beginning. It's Overwatch 1 with all of the updates we should have been getting the last two years, but haven't been. Um, it really isn't anything new. Like, it's, it really doesn't warrant the 2 part of Overwatch 2, because it's Overwatch 1.5 at best, like... And that's not a bad thing, because I've got hundreds of hours into it, I like playing it, it's my way to de-stress most nights. I'll play for an hour every other night, or every night, or, you know, depending on my free time. It's just kind of become my habit to play it for a little bit, pop some heads or whatever. But, uh... Yeah, but that being said, it's just, I mean, they gave it, like, a good, neat update as far as, like, cosmetics and how it looks, and all three new characters that are, you know, pretty decent. I enjoy them for the most part. The new maps are really cool. The new game mode push with the robot thing is interesting. It's nothing hugely innovative, but it's something new. I'll take it. I'm not going to complain. Um... They did get rid of a bunch of things, though, that I kind of wish they didn't, but it's nothing detrimental. They took away, like, the player cards at the end. They took away voting. They're still play of the game. There you three items. Um, and they took away, like, the border rank. Like, you know how you used to get a border that would, like, upgrade and then change colors from, like, bronze, silver, gold, so on and so forth? Um, and you have, like, a level number, like, 1 through 100 at the bottom. Yeah, they took that out. I mean, it's a legacy thing on your, you know, hero screen. Like, if you had it, but it doesn't seem to be going up. Um, loot boxes are still a thing, but you don't buy them anymore. And I just, I'm kind of split on the whole uh, season pass thing. I hate the idea. I absolutely hate it. That, oh, you gotta pay $10 every season and then actually play through and get a... Like, well, I was getting stuff just by playing before anyways, but... But ultimately, they're still handing out the loot boxes. Every level of Season Pass you get for free, so it really hasn't changed anything. The experience rate seems about similar. All it is is you get a couple bonus items for free, and then you gotta buy the Season Pass to get the rest. Again, I'm like, I'm on 75% hate it, 25% whatever, don't care. I'm, I'm kind of with Aaron on that, just, uh, I just won't buy it, like... Not that I was planning on it anyways, because I'll admit when the game first came out, I did go a little heavy-handed with loot boxes, and then I realized, oh, I must have a gambling addiction. I gotta stop this crap. I wouldn't say gambling addiction, because actually when I'm at the casino, I spend $20 tops gambling. If I run out of that, I'm like, well, I'm just gonna wander around and look at the machines for an hour. <laughs> but 
I take those out, I seem seems random. Fractimus, I think it had a lot to do with it going free to play, so a whole lot of new players were coming in, wouldn't feel intimidated and stuff. I'm sure there's probably some internal reason for it, but it does seem kind of pointless, because, like, the end cards of the game, like, I'd like to know how good I did, like, how many, you know, maybe charge kills as Reinhardt that I got and stuff like that, and show it off a little bit. And the voting, like, I always like to tip my healer at the end of a match with a vote, like, I know, again, it's insignificant and really doesn't affect the gameplay in the long run, but it's like, man, this kind of sucks. Um, let me get going on the game here. Uh, DK, okay, aim shot, shoot, okay. Um, some most of the characters, for the most part, have stayed the same, but there have been some alterations, which I really wish they didn't do, but it is what it is. They've done it in the past. It's nothing new. <laughs> yes! We set her up! Ah, that was way too soon. How do I not overextend? Ha! I'm just gonna bait her, screw it. Oh, Yoshi! Oh, we weren't even close. Never mind. <laughs> that one's tough because it's hard not to overextend the shot. Like, it's hard to aim somewhere in the middle and not just whack the pole every time. Come on, Shinulu, I'm not gonna say it, but you better. <laughs> um, They're still voting? Where? I don't see it. It just stops, you know, it says the final stats of your game pass and then stops and you gotta re go into the game. The game is designed to make you want to buy things. Yeah, it's free to play for a reason. It's literally designed to make you want to spend money. Whether it's seeing other people awesome looking at the skin, speed up your grinding, or constantly reminded to buy, buy, buy. It is. And, like, I I'm forgiving with that to a certain extent just because, yeah, the game does need to make money if it wants to keep getting updates, but was the model that they were working with not really, did it lose steam? Why? I just feel like it's just everything's jumping on a trend now. It's like, oh, everybody uses Season Pass, so I guess Overwatch has to, too. Oh, these sorts of games as a service are free to play. I guess Overwatch has to be now, too. Like, if you want to go free to play on something, make it World of Warcraft, because I would, I would totally play that a little bit more. Not in long terms, but I would definitely bounce back more if I didn't have to sink $15 a month in it still. Look, though, you're already excited about the Reaper skin. Once you see that more and more game, it gets close to Halloween, the desire to buy will be overwhelming. I mean, for some, yeah, but like I said, I'm just... I'm tempered on the fact that I blew that load when the game came out. <laughs> I spent it all on loot boxes, and after a certain point, it was just like, well, I pretty much have everything that I really want, and, like, anything new they come out with, it'll be hard for me to just be like, man, I really want... I mean, they already came out with the Winston Werewolf skin, and that was, like, the number one thing I was begging them for for years, and... I have it, so, um, yeah, I mean, there'll be neat stuff, and I'm sure I'll try to earn my way to it and stuff. Um, I don't think there are coins anymore either. Like, the coins you had rolled over, you can still buy stuff with them, but I'm not 100% sure if you can earn more. Maybe you still can. I haven't paid that close attention, but, um, for me, you have to hit right alt for voting. Oh! Oh, votes for your own team. No, I'm, that's not what I'm talking about, Aaron. That's, uh, uh... What the hell do they call that? That's something different. I know what you're talking about. That is still there. Yeah, where uh, endorsements, that's what it is. Endorsements, where you vote for, you know, uh, good player, good teammate, yada, yada. Yeah, no, that's different. I'm talking about at the tail end of it, where you voted either for yourself or the other team. Uh, they took that out, which I really don't see why, but whatever. I, I kind of saw it as a way to tip your healer or maybe encourage a new player because you see their portrait and number real low. You'd be like, well, they did all right. Give them a pop and maybe they'll stroke their ego and make them want to play more and stuff. But they just want more, more, more money. You know, that's with everybody, Bractimus. It's like modern gaming is kind of just... That's why the indie market is seemingly so much more better anymore. Uh, if Microsoft rolls WoW into Game Pass, I'll be back. <laughs> I remember I spent hundreds of dollars on loot box skins and that was before the duplicate credits. Oh, I forgot even that was a thing. You're right, bro. That sucked too. <laughs> but yeah, no, I mean, they'll they'll get theirs, I'm sure. But again, like with the season passing, I hate it. But ultimately, 
it doesn't really change the rate of how I how often I get things, I guess. Because, you, like I said, you still get loot boxes, because each battle pass has levels. I don't know what the max level is for a battle pass, but each level you get was about the same pace I feel like anyways. Maybe it's faster or slower, I don't know, but um, about the same rate as it was before. So I'm still getting loot boxes at, those, at a similar pace, but uh, I just can't buy them, A, and B, if I'm right, I think you can't get coins from duplicates. Maybe you can. I, I totally reel that back a little bit. You might still get coins for your duplicates. I, again, I haven't paid that much attention. I've only been able to play a couple of times, so. But, um, most of the characters, like I said, haven't really changed that drastically. I'm a little pissed about a couple things, like McCree's stun grenade got changed into, like, a grav grenade or something, where it quickly pulls people in and then does exploding damage or whatever, but I really like the stun better. That was better for interrupting ults and stuff. But, whatever. It is what it is. Um, Reinhardt's shield, they made a little bit weaker yet. Apparently Mei doesn't freeze people anymore except with her ult. She only just slows them down, apparently. I've yet to study that in depth, but... Oh shit, I should've used a mushroom. Should've drugged up! <laughs> um, voting thing happened, I quit after a while. Oh, okay. No, the voting thing was right up till two. I mean, you can still vote for whatever, and... But endorsements are still around it. But this one again, damn it. I'll lose. <laughs> uh, for several seasons of an event. Was the Olympics one? Yeah, Summer Games. I bought enough loot boxes for everything except the big Russian lady. White color suit variant. Tried and tried and tried. Never got it. Uh, Zarya, yeah. I think I know what you're talking about, too. <coughs> but like I said, overall, I've been pleased by this more than upset. Obviously, the real big thing I was excited for, and they totally flopped on that, was uh, they were supposed to release a uh, PvE mode for the game, and that never happened. <laughs> they say it's coming, but yeah, you can say that till you're blue in the face. I want to see the damn thing. Oh, and the other thing, too, is I play a lot of versus AI just because, like I said, um, I play that when I'm just playing to relieve stress and shit. If I'm playing with friends and stuff, I totally play Quick Play, Mystery Hero Song, and so forth. I like playing Total Mayhem a lot, too. Not AM Mayhem. <laughs> but, uh... I like to play versus AI after a long work night, and I just kind of want to blow off steam from a bad day or whatever, so... Steam, of course. I can't win that one, dude! There's no way! They pulled ahead of us after they hit a flame, and I hadn't. I don't know. Whatever, that's fine. I'm freaking loaded anyways, so... But, um... Yeah, the AI mode, they actually added... I don't... Dare I say it, I think they may have added the full cast to that roster. For all of Overwatch 1's duration, you only had six different bots. Or maybe seven or eight, but not the full roster of heroes would appear in that mode. And they made that mode, all three of them, a little bit tougher. So I'm happy about that, too. They don't all just move in the same <laughs> design anymore. They actually think and move around and try to, like, be more interactive. Those are all great memories. Going full main, freezing AI bots before they can leave their base. Yeah. <laughs> Put them behind a wall, freeze them all, the wall breaks, and just your team goes ham on them and rolls them over. Oh, that's so much fun setting that stuff up. But now it's a little bit more dynamic, so it's even more fun to try to do that now. I am... Crawling! I need to use these stupid mushrooms. I keep forgetting every round. But yeah. Once they come out with that proper AI or proper PvE mode or whatever, that's where I'll be tickled and like really, really, really enjoying it myself again. Hopefully. You know, I, I say that now, but yeah, watch it absolutely suck. But the only real super negative thing that's, and even again, I, I guess not that big of a deal, but a couple nights now I've logged in to play and half of my characters are locked, locked behind a battle pass. <laughs> but it's totally a glitch. They're not forcing me to do anything because it happened once. I logged in the, the next night and they were all back. I logged in the other night. They were like half locked again. And they even said like in Twitter and stuff like, we realize this is a problem and we're actively wor working on it. So... There's that one brief second where it first happened, though, I'm just like, are you... If I have to pay to use these characters that I have hundreds of hours into, 
I'm gone. <laughs> but there was just a brief second, and then I'm like, calm down, Inverse. It's a glitch. You know it's a glitch. <laughs> just chill. They're working on it. Yeah, I saw it a post. Yeah. No, they totally, yeah. I, I fully expected it to be a glitch because it's launched time, so. <clears throat> uh, watch, you have to pay for PV mode. I think that was the plan, Brock, from the beginning, was for Overwatch 2, you had the Initially, you had to pay for Overwatch 2, and then they decided to do the free-to-play thing, but um, I honestly wouldn't be surprised if you had to pay for the PV stuff, and if it's reasonable, I'll be willing to do it, because how many hours have I gotten out of this game, and will I continue to do more, you know? I've paid the base 60 bucks way back in the day, and then whatever amount for loot boxes, but that was optional. <laughs> Uh, every run of Junkenstein costs a dollar. If it's like that, then okay, forget it. But I think the base, pay it once and you get it. I think I saw they wanted to do something like 40 bucks or something. Again, that was so long ago, they've probably completely reversed their decisions about it. I'm sure with this bumpy launch, they're going to be like, if we want people to continue playing, we might not be able to charge them for that. All right, anyway, uh, polls for speed. <laughs> Alright. Do it. 25 cents to reload your weapon. You have to melee everything to death. See you shitties later! Hit every rock on the way down, guys. Go, Ouija. I think they hit every single goddamn rock on the way down. <laughs> oh no, melee is five cents per swing. Unless you're Reinhardt, then it's free. It's free for the first three swings. <laughs> uh, but yeah ultimately I'm having fun with it I just kind of wish they all do on their promise with that PvE mode but whatever you know what it'll be another fresh breath of air here in a few months or a year or however long it takes I'm still playing the damn game after it's been like five years six years question mark then it's obviously doing something to keep me coming back. First three swings are always free, yeah. <laughs> to recharge your shield, yeah, you have to pay more. <laughs> Insert coin. Attach your credit card to your Battle.net account and you'll get charged for free. Three times a season. <laughs> Come on, choose your freaking manor out. My expectations for Diablo 4 couldn't be lower at this point. I don't know hardly anything at all about Diablo 4, and I'm keeping it that way. Oh my god, I hit the hot spot. Freaking Bowser's spot. Oof! I got mashed by the big man himself. Uh, the loser must hand over half of all coins. Oof. Let's make it Daisy. She's got the most. We'll see. I'm super interested in four just for the Druid alone. Outside of that. I don't know. I played enough 3 and 2. I'd probably go back to Resurrect 2 Resurrected before I really care too much about Diablo again, but but um, if I wanted to play a top-down clicker, uh, Shinulu was getting into me, getting me into Path of Exile, which I gotta get back into, uh, but yeah. That Path of Exile is pretty good. That's free to play too. But I really haven't been, haven't felt any pressure to buy anything, so... Yeah, I better hear the rules for this. Listen up, weaklings. I'm going to explain the rules of this game. So no snoozing. 
Blow up Master Bowser's balloon real big like. Ugh. What are we doing here? This is terrifying. Just pound on his pump to inflate his balloon. Guys, I don't know if I care for where this is going. Look at that casual look on his face while he's sitting in that chair. All spread eagle too. This is questionable. Whoop! Ground pound on his pump. Uh, press A, press A, press A! The higher you jump, the more air you... Oh. More Bowser. Oh, if you overinflate the balloon or don't pump at all. Oh, I know, I know. Bowser comes. Oh, no, you roast. Take marshmallows at a campfire. It's all getting whack in it. Bleah. My face is gonna be huge. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm. Get that donkey on my schlong. Yeah. Oh. Bigger! Oh! <laughs> oh, right! Oh! Yeah! Mm. No time for love, Dr. Jones. Getting close! Getting close! All right! I'm hedging! I'm hedging! I'm hedging! Shit. He's gonna burst! He's gonna burst! The flight beat back on the menu, boy! Oh, yeah! Arr, arr. Oh, no! It's gonna make it back to me, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs> oh, a fucking chorus! Giggity! Ah, oh, all right, that's fine. Thirty coins is not the end of the game, I guess. <laughs> Look at the eyes. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, damn. He's sitting on the balloon. Yeah. It's just because it's being developed by Activision Blizzard. They're butchering everything. Yeah. Hey, don't screw around. You screw around too much. <sighs> Whatever, Bowser. DK looks disappointed even though he didn't lose. Whew. That was something. Oh, now I get singled out. <laughs> awesome. Oh. Yeah, no, Blizzard used to be one of my favorite companies, but you're right, ever since Activision bought it, all well, took a stake in it, it's... Activision kind of poisons everything they touch, but I think that's kind of common knowledge at this point. Light a fuse, that's all I need to do. But, you know... When you go triple A, that shit seems to happen. That's why I'm so happy a lot of these indie games get to have such a chance anymore. Indie games have been really great the last few years. Oh. And like the fact that these triple A games are kind of flubbing shit up a lot. Oh, two for one! Oof. Hmm, A or Y, A or Y. Bit luck on that side, let's try it again. Finish. Ah, Daisy got it. Or was it, yeah, it was Daisy. Son of bitch. 
chance games. Fun times. All right. Oh, boy, boy. Big DK coming through. Big DK energy. Uh, get my ass groove in again. Ooh. Speaking of loot boxes. <laughs> I feel like the scratch ticket one you like rarely win anything off of. Don't be so sad. Hey, you won three coins. There you go. Alright, I'm gonna finally use the damn mushroom. <laughs> that I keep forgetting to use for like the last five turns. <laughs> Mario Party, the OG loot box sim. Pretty much. Slime time. Is this Nickelodeon? Supposed to reach the middle platform to win. What was this one again? Oh, you be pulled back in the big slime, so don't give up till you're done. A button. That's all I need to know. Yeah, let's get in a position here, chat. Slime power. Yeah, ten for the weege. There's my duplicate money. I love how sad DK looks at his portrait because he's dead last right now. <laughs> I just wanted bananas. I got dragged into this. Poor Seth Rogen. I just wanted bananas, man. I'm gonna smoke this banana. Fuck it. <laughs> Oh shit, she's had enough. She's just gonna bring the star to her next round. Well, the other way around. Maybe this one flies her to it, I forget. Oh shit! Streams here. Smash! Alright, I 
take another hit. Oof. Oof. <laughs> Aww. I want my money back. I never get to stay here. You summon a tsunami. The sick can I pay? This is a scam. Ah. Weak. Weak. Yeah, son of a bitch. It's hard to be hopeful about this one when the computer can predict it before it even... Bubble even comes up. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> this is way fucking tough. Uh, green corn dog green. Alright. Sort of hanging in there. Oh my god! How? How? Uh, damn, bro! Oh, see, only because I memorized those three, and two of the three were what I needed. <sighs> Speaking of Jack Black, have you ever played Brutal Legend? I have not played Brutal Legend. <laughs> Back when I got my Xbox 360 jailbroke, <laughs> if you want to call it that, um, I got a copy of it, I just never got around to play it before lightning struck it, and I couldn't play jailbroken games anymore. <laughs> I played the original Dragon Age 2. Wahoo! Ah I'm so excited about this! <laughs> wow! <laughs> wow! Your belly button is so huge! Yeah, I have, can't say I've had the pleasure, though, Rick. I remember a house got hit by lightning and the Ethernet port of your 360 got fried, right? <laughs> so, yeah, lightning struck. I was having, like, a barbecue, of all things, with my friends over. Day was going great. The storm suddenly rolls in midway through while I'm cooking. <coughs> <coughs> so... I half-ass pulled the grill in and had a fan blowing so all the smoke and stuff would go out, but I could still cook and not get rained on, right? Well, we're doing that, and out of nowhere, lightning strikes. I swear it was feet away. I swear to God. It, it obviously wasn't, but it was close enough. It struck, it took out half of the electronics in the house, and I was so happy to be hosting Halo Party during this barbecue during the day, and my... Xbox 360 was hooked up to the TV and it was hooked up through an Ethernet cord to John's in the other room, his 360, on another TV so nobody could screen watch, right? Well, when that lightning struck, it took out the modem on my 360, like, the you know, whatever, the router, whatever, and the electrical charge went through the cord because John unplugged his from the wall. Mine was still plugged in, but... It went through the Ethernet cord and just fried his completely, because it was at the end of the circuit, I'm assuming. <clears throat> but yeah, it only took the router out on mine. Like, it still played single-player games, it still did everything else, it just didn't detect that it had a router or a modem or whatever anymore. So I thought that was kind of funny, but... Um, yeah, ultimately ended up red ringing after a while, like... This was like a year later or something like that, and that's when... I took it to the guy to fix it or whatever, and he's like, well, I can fix it and he's like but i can also upgrade it for you ha -cha, cha 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 so i was like how much more is that and i'm like 
well shit, by the time I buy two games, I could have done this, so I did. But I didn't really go anywhere with it, like I said, it ended up... I think that M1 ended up bricking after about another year or two. And that was that they came up with the Slims by then, or whatever those were called. Like the black ones, you know, that... Anyway, anyway, I uh, ended up just buying one of those, and I've been using... Well, I used it for a while, but... It's been hooked up to my TV in my bedroom ever since I moved in this house, and I've used it a grand total of like two times to watch movies in bed. I usually just watch movies out in my living room and pass out on the couch and then go to bed, but... Oh yeah, everybody, yeah, uh, TV blew up too, yep. Parents, expensive 3D TV ended up blowing up. <laughs> but insurance covered <clears throat> just about, well... I think if I remember correctly, they covered 75% of the total cost of everything, so we mostly got our money back for that stuff, but... Ha! Huh, I showed up just after that. I think you did, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that was crazy. That was the party that Thor visited. <laughs> I always like to kid around. Where am I going? Daisy? <clears throat> Endure my falling ass, Daisy. Oh, this is the one. I'm probably not going to win this one, but hopefully the rumble will work. Guess we'll find out. I tried fixing the rumble beforehand. think it is. Nope. Son of a bitch, I thought I activated it. Okay, go, go man, go. Go dog, go. so incredibly fast. <laughs> at least I was a lot closer that time. I wasn't at the freaking bottom like it was the first time. I won't complain. That was a learning moment there. That's awful. I can remember living on Water Street. The lightning bolt hit the tree in the backyard. It blew a lot of the bark off the tree, but it fried the ethernet port on the back of my PC. Luckily, that was all it did, but damn, was it loud. Yeah, it was really loud. Um, Tom had even brought his dog over at the time, and the dog, like, screamed and ran to the back of the garage. It was that close. And then it proceeded to eat the broom handle of my parents' broom that they had in there because it was so stressed out afterwards. I feel bad, but what can you do? I mean, it's lightning. Are we? Oh, I was gonna say, are we all gonna end up on the same square now? <laughs> yeah, no, it's it's woo, a lot all at once. One of the most interesting phenomenons in the world to me: electricity and lightning. But holy smokes, you do not want to mess with it. Um, I'm pretty much used up what I need to use up. I want to save that Mega Mushroom. Just in case. Daisy. Like the zombie movie. Blame it on the crane! Frazier or Niles? Hold on, hold on. Gotta do it. There we go. <clears throat> One player uses crane to capture the other three. The other three must avoid the claw. That Jim Carrey move. Liar, liar, I think. 
Press to move forward. Really slower. Just move. <laughs> All right. Let's botch this. Yeah. I can say you dog bolted. <laughs> oh, immediate. I was gonna say immediately captured. Awesome. Like I can do much about this. This is dumb. Bro. Fuck off. Fuck off. I don't want it. Shit. There's the. Fuck off. Fuck off. Okay. So I thought. Bitch. You gotta avoid this for that long. Holy smokes. Uh, if you got dick, you got dick. Woo, suck it. <laughs> Woo, suck it. <laughs> Yoshi, I don't give a damn about him. Woo, see ya later. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. I'm great with my balls. Wait. <laughs> Boo! <laughs> Here, Shinulu, I'll do that for you. There, that's for Shinulu. <laughs> soundbite it chose for that just it, it's subtle but you hear it like while they're booing you hear somebody going you suck <laughs> hop on my back let's have a ride ahoy that was the most riveting ride of her life right there whopping three feet over <laughs> What do we got here? We got Cabana Chat. I'm wondering where that star moved on to. Right there. Uh, see, that's doable, but fuck it, let's do it. I'm gonna roll right over it, aren't I? Okay, encouraging. Uh, not so encouraging, maybe. Yeah, I'm gonna roll right by it, aren't I? Uh, view map. I have 12. One, two, three. Yeah, that'll way roll over it. Two. That'll go completely wrong direction, too. Well, shit. I was kind of hoping I'd land in that sweet spot between the cabana stuff and that. Hmm. Yeah, I will run right by it. Well, might as well go left then. <clears throat> this is gonna hurt. <gasps> oh my ass! Uh oh, what did I do? Oh, it's just a battle game. Well, just a battle game, but... 30 coins every ball. Oh, this is gonna be big. This is gonna be big. Oh, I get to choose. Uh, shit. Let's go this one. What the hell? Oh, rumble fishing. I don't have rumble. Let me double check. This sucks, dude. I can't win this. I can't do anything with this. Let's see if I can see my options. It works. Yes. Unless this worked, I'm not gonna get this. Star. 
Oh, I don't get a rumble. I'm gonna waste everybody's time. Whatever. This is not encouraging. I just lost 30 coins for no good reason. Uh, okay, maybe I got a little bit. One coin. Watch. One coin. I'm sorry, Midas. My fucking last place got that pity coin and not me. It's fucking beyond me, but what the fuck ever. On a game, I could not win. Yeesh. Okay, good. I'll fucking take some of it back here. The dude is. Fuck the haters, let's go! Let's play with bombs some more. <laughs> no fire danger. Start. Human garbage. Perfect victory. I have to play it. Hold on. Fatality. Perfect victory. Alright, well there's like, what, 10 back of that 30? Woo! Smash. <laughs> the dolphin takes one look at DK, he's like, Oh god, we're sinking, aren't we? Oh no, that was that whopping three foot ride, never mind. Didn't even get the chance. <laughs> wow. That was the most productive turn of the century. She just lost a turn. It rarely happens, but that literally was lose a turn. Oh no! He got a free fucking star. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Smash that like button! <laughs> See you shitties later! I'm going the other way! <laughs> Let me guess. Breeze right by the star. This one again! I cannot win this one. It's, it's scientifically proven. Right. But this is on me, not on a lack of rumble. See? How? Fucking how? Oh, what the hell ever. We're not getting any better at that, right? Uh. Prime Twitch content right there. <laughs> this too. <laughs> I really hope she gets... Was it a seven? Uh... Seventy-nine. It was. 
<laughs> I bet she was hoping for a Mega Mushroom so she could pass that dolphin again. Please let her land on again. Oh my god, everybody's hung up on this damn dolphin. It's like, why am I working so hard right now? I only have two spots on the whole board. Even I can't get away from a pole, jeez. Not the cheap, cheap thing. Ugh. Your grandpa's on the inflate font, but too deflated. No, okay, yeah, time it with your partner. Just like Bowser. Bruh! Are the ass masters wait <laughs> all right thank you DK you're loaded bro buy some stars okay buy a star and then call it good there and don't do any more better give on that goddamn dolphin oh no okay <laughs> B -b 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 <laughs> He's got so much money. <laughs> she almost hit it again for like the third time in a row. She can still get a one. Unless she, well, yeah, she has a tiny mushroom. Oh my god, all three of them. I'm the only one that pulled away. Only because I used it in reverse. <laughs> Shit, and even then I can't squeeze away from it. All right, all right, all right. No bullshit. No bullshit. Eh, sus. This could be bullshit. Forget what this is even is. Round that frozen powder away the snowballs. Ah, uh, okay. Move right before the blizzards throw their snowballs. They'll stop moving just before they throw. Okay. Could be bullshit. Always possible. Snowy with a chance of bullshit. Blah. Son of a bitch. That big one distracted me just enough. Okay, that one wasn't a bullshit one. That was absolutely me twitching out at the big one. I always get distracted by the big ones. <laughs> oh, and DK pulls away from the dolphin loop. Excuse me, sir. Can you help me build my scam? Now it's mega scam worthy. Oh, he finally got one. Woo! We're like in the last quarter of this game. <laughs> and DK finally gets his start. So now. Oh, dude. So, what somebody needs to do out there, and I would totally play it if this happened, after the new Super Mario movie comes out, what was it, April next year? Somebody who should totally mod this game to have the voice lines of the movie, whatever ones that seem appropriate, dub over whatever sound effects that this has. It's like Seth Rogen Donkey Kong. Instead of Donkey Kong just going, rrr, rrr, yeah, it would be like, let's smoke this banana and see how it tastes, or whatever else ridiculous stuff. I know he's not going to say that in the movie, but come on, it's Seth Rogen. You know he'd want to. 
This is where DK makes his move. We got a strong monkey in the bottom half. <laughs> oh, and Yoshi gets caught by the dolphin. Not everybody escapes. God damn it! I don't want to ride the dolphin! Okay, I have no items, so let's pray I don't get caught up. Yeah, 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 okay. I don't get caught up, and it's sweet. However... Over there. Daisy will hit it first, probably. Well, she could get some bad rolls, I guess. Oh, or I could just port to her. Or DK, whatever. <laughs> Furthest away from the start out. Well, okay, me and him are tied for that. Excuse me. Excuse me. Let's <sighs> hope to be done with this one. This is why I think the 30s is a nice sweet spot for this. Stop. Yoshi! Well, we lost that one because of you. Nice corn dog hamburger. Still in it. It's so tough with the CPU because they know already where everything's at. Ah. <laughs> but anyway, yeah. Ooh! Five turns left. Lucky ticket. I don't even have a lucky ticket. And... Everybody loses! Oh, wait. That was Luigi. Okay. What in the point is that? Man, that seems like a... Long stretch for anybody to win there, even if all four of us had tickets. But do take heart, luck has not forsaken you. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it did, but okay. <laughs> oh, dead last, jeez. Not by that much. Last five turn, roulette can begin. Our lucky spinner is Daisy. <laughs> All red and blue spaces are now doubled. Oh, Midas left. Midas. Monkey solely exists to thrive on everybody else's pain. Alright, I'm getting sweaty, you guys. They're closing in. <laughs> Shit! That's. Oh! <laughs> Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong. 
Worst spot on the board to be here right now. To... Ah, Yoshi got sucked by the dolphin again. Loves that blowhole. No, Yoshi's addicted to it because he gets to ride something else for a change. And I got fucked. I got the worst spot on the board now. No, I reject it. Ah, uh, well, there it is. That sucks. All I needed was one more on that dice, and I would have been fine. Roll a one. Next round. Please. Roll a one. Ooh. What do we got here, Governor? Hello, Governor. Oh, yeah, this one. Actually, um, I, uh, uh, I kind of like this one. <laughs> Same spot as before, too. Run! Jesus, see, Yoshi's pretty aces at this one, isn't he? Shit! Save some for the rest of us, Yoshi! Yeah! Oh, there was no way to win that! Shitty. Wow! Yoshi really took that one, huh? But we got three boxes and a fucking jelly bean block. We we all there's no way to avoid that. And of course I spawned like two seconds after everybody else. Alright. Whatever. I bitch so much, but I'm in first place. Oh, DK, that sucks, man. Yoshi was dynamite. Oh, you used that one square too late, Daisy. Bummer. Oh no! Oh no! Uh, <laughs> say, uh, Daisy? <laughs> you there? Girl, wake up? <laughs> oh! And she's right back on the dolphin loop! Oh, I'm so excited for this. Will Yoshi break the dolphin loop? We'll find out next turn. Maybe. One, one, one. Everybody, chat. One, one, one. Not three. <laughs> oh well. Six coins is good too. Not as good as a star, but whatever. I'll see myself out. <laughs> one, one, one. <sighs> oh, can all other try to extinguish? Okay. I remember this one now. This one's a little tricky, but it's doable. Oh god! Stop. This is like Darkness Falls where the Tooth Fairy's gonna eat ya. Monkey! To pay for your sins! Spank the monkey! Got him. That monkey be wet. Look how much cash DK has. Three left. Big monkey. Big American monkey. Wow, wow, he's cruising. Look at him go. He's not getting stuck in that dolphin loop today. 
Although he's gonna pay the cabana. Oh boy, howdy. There goes those riches. Smash! You'd think you'd learn to build this goddamn thing to be a little bit more resistant to tides, you know? Yeah, you would. You would. Hey! I'll take it! Ha-ha! <laughs> she helped me out, actually. <laughs> Damn it, I wanted to make him many, not me. <laughs> Shit. I would have been mad now if I roll that one, because if I'm big, then I'm just going to cruise right by the star spot. But I'm nowhere in the vicinity, so... Mm. They have made me big. Oh god, and I still just roll three. If for love of God, not dungeon duos. It's really hard to freaking win one that I don't have a motor for. God damn it. Come on! Oh my fucking god. They fuck up how many times and still get ahead of me? Stop beating there for the last five seconds of that. <laughs> that was the first one I've ever gotten of this. Admittedly, when I played it back when I was a lot younger, I won a little bit more, but I actually had motors in the damn controller that spun. The rumble feature. Dolphin Lou! Alright, I'm gonna start celebrating the Dolphin Lou because this is a thing now. <laughs> love, love, jump, jump. Exactly. Oh, Yoshi ain't fucking around now. <laughs> I wanna get out of the goddamn Dolphin Loop. Two ones. Two ones. Do it. Aw, bummer. I would've laughed so damn hard. Or two ones and a three or something. Or a one and a two, I mean. Daisy's just eternally caught in that damn loop. Well, Yoshi was too, but... Mm. Alright, now I'm in the dolphin loop. <laughs> sure. Yeah! <laughs> Oh man, the star's right next to that hot Bowser spot. Ooh. Uh, yes, nobody can lose. Okay. Move speed up, slow down. Do, 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 okay.
All right, DK. Get that money. Ah, barely, barely. Come on, come on. Oh, shit. That's tough. Wow. Even spread. So for the first half of that, I was just holding it down, thinking the longer you hold it, the faster you go, and he'll rise up more. But it's actually like a, uh, a gear-based system. You have to tap it. Like up, up, down, down. Still, not bad breaking even, not knowing exactly how to play half the time. Last turn. Time to make the magic happen. Any plans for the day off? Ah, just the usual. I'm not gonna try to spend much money because I'm gonna be spending money this weekend already, so the weekend's kind of the big part, so. Like I said, I'm gonna be going to that Halloween party down at the bar that I like to go to in Lansing and uh, <laughs> debating going to that Comic Con or not. We'll see. I think I'm just gonna Wake up Sunday morning and decide then if I feel like going or not. We'll see. That hairy ass arm. Try again. And you don't get a freaking lottery ticket because it's past that now. <laughs> what other lottery ticket you get with that? I'm gonna watch me more Cobra Kai. That's what I'm gonna do. That new season came out not too terrible long ago. <laughs> Everybody's getting a lottery shop and like the not the scratcher part, but where you pick you know, three characters or whatever. That lottery. And nobody's won anything yet. This was a scam, too. There are no winners. <laughs> but I guess you're not paying anything for it, so... <laughs> Where's the scam? There's really no point in using my uh, Mega Mushroom. It's just gonna put me in the cabana. Here, I'll get the damn cabana anyways! Oh fuck yes, Jesus. I purposely didn't use the Mega Mushroom because I thought I'd get a lower number. Oh, whatever. Five coins for your garbage cabana that I've ripped, gotten ripped off three or four times now. My beautiful cabana, it's been destroyed. Why do I keep building on a floodplain? Fish in drips. This one again. Do -do 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 -do. Okay. Actually, I should switch side of my. Okay, this side. Man! Oh, we were so close. <clears throat> Two button presses away. Ah. 
Not that it's an excuse, but the buttons look Dang like it, Bobby. GameCube controller buttons, and I'm using the 360, so there's a little translation, but it's not too bad because I mapped the GameCube to have the same letters as this. Fortunately, X, Y, A, B are popular across the board for buttons. Looking at you, PlayStation. Actually, no, out of the three, I actually prefer the PlayStation symbols better. Because, you know, certain systems swap those two button locations on the face. <laughs> All right. Here we go! <laughs> Our journey has ended, and here are the results. Look at the number of stars. I mean, I'm sitting pretty right now, but there's bonus stars. I think there's three. Bing! Here come the bonus star results. Uh, I wish they would adopt some universal format for the face buttons. I don't care what, whether they choose, just pick one and stick with it. I absolutely... I got a bad feeling about this. I absolutely agree, Brack. Like, just, you know, yeah, a universal. That's all it needs to be. <laughs> Like, don't swap the A, B buttons, X, Y buttons, yada, 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 like, eh, come on, guys. I'll play, that'd be beneficial to the players. It literally wouldn't hurt any cis console thing, I think. I mean, other than, like, oh, well, it's been established for years that this is this way, and yada, yada, like, eh, whatever. Star. There are too many game stars. I'm the best. I'm a the best. All right, I'm feeling pretty good about this. I want to say this is going to be me, but man, DK was freaking banking for a while there. All right, cool. I've lost a couple of versus games that have dished out a lot of coins. Don't act like you're not impressed. 60% of the time, it works every time. Ooh, Yoshi. Yeah, riding that goddamn dolphin paid off, didn't it, Yoshi? <laughs> That's what that was for. All right, I took it, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, how couldn't I? Daisy and Yoshi are the only ones that got stars. Hells yeah! Fought for that one. Boom! I'm a departy star. star. Even on hard mode. Woo! All right. Little screeny cap. Yeah, boy. Cool. Looky there, six. That was hard mode. Woo! Detailed results. Let's investigate. Wow, 100? Okay. Yeah, we tied for 216. How cool is that? Mini game coins. Coins you own during the game. The greatest number. Okay. Blue spaces are pretty even. I lucked out there on the reds. Yeah, absolutely, Daisy and Yoshi were racking up the happening spots on that dolphin, man. <laughs> I guess we'll take second. <laughs> yes, I guess we'll take seconds. Go, go, wait, <coughs> excuse me. Dolphin, dolphin. <laughs> we'll take the seconds. Dolphin. DK's the only one that got one of those. Yeah, Yoshi tap danced on the Bowser a little bit. Dang. Warp spaces. Smeagol, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. That was fun. I had to really work for it. But <laughs> All right, guys. We're going to take a quick break, ski again, while I pee and grab another drink. I still got a little bit left here, but that'll end quickly, I'm sure. Um, I'm going to take a five-minute break to take care of, you know, the huge... And then we're going to come back. I want to play. I've been itching to play some Family Feud with you guys for a little bit. So we're going to come back to that. 
So sit tight. We're not done. We'll have some more fun. See you all after about five minutes or so.
All right, we are back. Let me make a quick adjustment here, maybe. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, let's play it. The Feud. I am excited to play this. This game is absolute bullshit, but I'm always excited to boot it up and play with you guys. Time for The Feud. That's right. Here's the same old bullshit. Cool. All right, all right, all right. Hold on. I need to make one quick adjustment because you are kind of half blacked out yet. There. Should work, right? Cool. I apologize. I kind of... I'm facing away from the game, oh my god. I always like to have it so I'm facing in, so I look like I'm looking at it to you guys too, but... I have... Not recently, but since building my new computer, I rearranged my stuff a little bit to fit better in here. And it just so happens the TV fits over here on this new side table I have, which frees up so much space on my desk. So I used to have my little mini TV for the Switch stuff over here on the desk, next to the laptop that I monitor <laughs> And, you know, that worked out pretty good, but it did severely limit my desk space. So when I was uh, building this new one, and Broctimus Prime gave me this really bitch a giant monitor that I've really been enjoying a lot since it started to use it. Because all my monitors are like, like that tiny. <laughs> I'm thrifty. I try to find good deals on monitors, but man, Brock hooked me up with this beautiful beast of a monitor and been enjoying it. So, so I needed more room for my desk, <laughs> in the long story short. Get the feud going. Don't connect me. Why is not connect not an option? I'm just gonna cancel every time. Cool. Skip. <laughs> Don't care. Time for the feud. The game is a bit loud versus you. Thank you for letting me know. I'll go right about there. Let's see if that helps. Nope, it wasn't the mic at all. Um, I'm doing something slightly different. I used to have a completely different scene for my Switch, but since then I've implemented it into the main overlay that I use for just about everything else. Um, it does look really weird that I'm facing the other direction. Oh, oh well, that's a, that's a me thing. I'm not going to let it bug me too much. But how's that sound? Any better? Can you make me out better? Can you make out with me better? <laughs> God, I'm stupid. Don't mind me. All right, I didn't mean to back out. See, I was using A button to confirm everything on the bottom of the face screen, and now the A button I'm playing with the actual Switch controller now is on the right side of the face. Awesome, cool. I'm glad, thank you. Classic. And as always, chat, you know the, uh, the rules here. You know the rules, and so do I. All right, team captain, that gonna be me. I'm gonna stick with my pale chihuahua. Proctimus, I assume you're in. <laughs> Mr. Horse. All right, I'll give y'all a little bit of a chance to respond, but if you would like to play the family feud with us, you can play, sort of. You will be playing through me. You'll give me your answers and I will plug them in. If anybody out there lurking has, these games take roughly 20 to 30 minutes, depending on how well we do. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of bullshit. Um, just all I really need you to do is stick around for that time and give me, feed me answers. It <laughs> better, you know it. Just stick with the Daisy theme. AM, do you want in? I'll absolutely put you in. But uh, I'll give anybody lurking. I mean, you see we have three slots open. I'd be glad to play with y'all. I just need you to, you know, be ready to insert some answers when your turn rolls around. Um, unfortunately, I mean, it makes sense, but the game is on a timer, so I can't really stop it. Even if I hit the home button, the timer still runs, so I can't really cheat. <laughs> sure, I got to pee, though, so BRB. Okay. All right, you go ahead and take that pee real quick, dude. I'll put you in, and uh, we'll wait for a minute or two more if any lurkers want to jump in. That dude looks new. Did we make that last time? I think we did mess around him a little bit. Not a lot of it. Yeah, because I think we made this dude too. But anyway, um, 
yeah, AM's in. We're going to wait a minute for him to come back. If anybody out there is lurking, wants to join, please let me know now, because once AM gets back, we're going to plug him in and get going. Don't remember. He probably wants the professor. But do 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 I'll have a sip real quick. I should drink this from the other side. This is a Duck Dynasty cup. I know nothing about Duck Dynasty. I frankly don't really care about it. I've heard things about it. It's like, eh, sounds dumb. <laughs> if it's their thing, power to you. I won't judge you for it. This cup was just cheap as shit, and I like these Freezy cups. I bought it years ago. <laughs> I don't even know if... I think it was just on clearance at the store. But there are those cups with the little gel lining in it and you throw it in your freezer and it keeps your drink a lot colder for a lot longer but i had a red wings one for the longest time but the handle eventually broke off of that so i just ended up pitching it because i don't want to hold a cold cup while i'm trying to drink but uh yeah as soon as am gets back we'll get this game rolling he's got to let me know what character he wants so i suspect he's probably gonna want the mad doctor who knows? He might surprise me. I'll try to further customize some of these other bland-looking characters. I mean, we've earned enough money to be able to, uh... <laughs> you know what? Let's do that real quick. While Ingham's messing around peeing, maybe we'll get a minute. Let's see what we have here. Uh... You're pretty plain. I'm fine with that. Oh, your face. That's fine. Crazy yellow eyes, why not? So, I don't know. Blue, sure. Oh, something outrageous. Outrageous, actually, that's really not all that outrageous anymore, I guess. Dreadlocks, side shave, spiky flat top, afro. Never go wrong with a good afro. I don't know, these are. Uh, here we go. The crazy looking locks. Let's do that. Alright, um, let's. Oh, we gotta. Okay, yeah, look at how much money we got. We can buy any of those. Something cool. California. -A. Ooh, cat jammies. I think we're going with the, uh, not jammies, but yeah, let's do it. Confirm. Pants. Let's say it probably negates any pants. All right, that's fair. Whatever. Shoes. What are these? Don't really say gold plated or something. They don't have any ridiculous looking Crocs. Dude, the ch tennis shoes totally don't go. Hold on, cycle color? What's this? Nothing fancy. Let's go the flesh tone. Oh, that looks gross. Even though, like, we'll totally see their shoes during this game at all. Backwards cap. Um, shades. Oh, yeah, they're cool. Oh, there we go. Boom. That matches the motif we're going with. Oh, and makeup, all right. What do we got here? Oh, we got stars. Old lady. Mustache. Yeah, I'm liking the stars. Let's do it. Uh -huh. Oh, cycle color. Hold on. Oh, yeah, we can make it match. Let's do it. Nice. Nav. Change name. What's sassy? I like sassy. We're keeping sassy. Sassy. Cool. All right, AM's back. <laughs> No, your face. I should have gone with the scrubs coat. So so is your face. <laughs> Alright, AM. You're back. Let's get going. Boom. I was just wasting a little bit of time while you peed. Alright, AM, who do you want? I'm guessing Mad Doctor, but I wanted to make sure. I slowly rotate through these. Yeah, CSE. <laughs> or we could ah yeah yeah. Hold on. Hold the phone. Um you, you're playing. Hold on, hold on. Idea, idea. 
idea. You might like this, I don't know. It'll only take a minute. Alright, so we're gonna go lady. We're gonna go white skin. Um, sort of dainty features. That's pretty dainty. Alright. Eyes, I think, are brown. Don't quote me, I don't care. That's. No? That's pretty close. And then. Oh, what's her? Kinda like that. Oh. Mm. Sort of. Not really. Sort of, not really again. Nothing comes really super close, so we're gonna go... This looks okay enough. Now is it possible? This is the part that's gonna make or break it. Cavalier looking shit. Oh. <laughs> you know what? That might work. Hold on. La 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 band. What the crap? I was hoping for more dress options, I guess, but... Okay, no, that's fine. This this should do. What are the colors? Yeah, we'll go with the orange. All right, confirm. Uh, yeah, I wish there was more dress options, but I guess there aren't. Okay then, well, you know what, we're not going to be looking at the bomb half this character much anyways, so... Color, color... None of those work. <clears throat> yeah. Alright, I'm being too picky. This should work. Sure. Sure, these work. Cool. Um, does she have? I'm trying to make Daisy if it isn't already obvious. I'm not gonna come anywhere close because I thought I had more options in this. It was kind of the dress was gonna be the make or break part of it. Funny looking mask stuff down here though. I don't think I could get the weird looking fox mask, but hey, <laughs> there, there's the professor's face. Hey, right, anyway, um, yeah, bummer, dude. Cycle color. Here, we'll put the orange bow for kicks, since there's no daisy to go with it. And why not freckles? Just because I said so. Okay, sexist game. It's all pants, <laughs> right? <laughs> well, I tried. That's not too far, right? All right, now we'll finally get going. Sorry, I totally like add out there for a moment. All right, AM, do you want our fake-ass Daisy or do you prefer somebody else? I thought it was gonna be a good idea. She didn't turn out terrible, I guess, but... There. Give me a shout who you want. <laughs> you can go by position or just describe them. All you went through all the effort, might as well go with the fake Daisy. All right, fake Z. Hi. We'll call her fake Z. I don't know what her real name was, but too late to edit it now. Done, we're starting, let's do this. Fake Z. I'll rename her later, but we're still of the Clam Slapper tribe, so. All right. I know what Brock's gonna say, but do we uh, stick with your favorite family ever, Brock, or do we try something different? I think I know what Brock's answer is going to be. Maybe we'll just do it anyway. We'll do it anyways, because I know he's going to have a good time. <laughs> yeah, there it is. I didn't even need to wait. I knew your answer. I'm not even going to say it. <laughs> uh. Good evening, and welcome to Family Feud. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me.
excuse me. There's your family, Rack. Welcome to the show. I'm Lucky McCoy. Yeah, I'm sure you are. Dick. Who are the two families feuding it out? Let me know if you can hear him, all right. <clears throat> I'm thinking the sound's at a good level, but this family is looking sharp. The game is quiet. Yeah, I kind of figured. If the music's oh, always loud in the beginning. Grooves, it's the Lees. I'm gonna stick it right about there. That should be good. You want to know how? Thank you guys for letting me know. It's very simple. We've surveyed 100 people, and you need to guess the answers awesome. they've come up okay, with good. to our questions. The team that does the best goes on to play fast money and has the chance to win 20,000 bucks. I hope that's better. All right, let's get this show on the road. My meters are saying it is, but <laughs> meters mean nothing. <laughs> Your guys' opinion is way better. Face -off. I'm going to need one person from each family to join me right now. Chihuahua's growing on me, man. I like it. How happy this dude is. See. Top oh four answers up on the board. Sleeping dog. Be sure to buzz in when you've got an answer to the survey question. If you're first to find the number one answer, you get to decide if your family will play or pass the round. We took a survey of 100 people, asking them, Name something you'd hate to discover was missing on the morning of your wedding. You're up first. <laughs> uh, do we? <laughs> the wife. <laughs> okay. Let's see if the board's got it. Ring. That's the number one, but. A capital K, which means it's there. But there's still a better one. Correct with a Let's capital K. The top answer. Lucky. Go back to school, bro. Hate to discover was missing on the morning of. I was gonna suggest the spouse. Yeah, going with the bride. <laughs> Flowers. Feeling lucky? Is it on the board? But would we put fiance Flowers. or like bride? I don't know, man. No points. Awesome. You won the face off. So tell me, play or pass? Do we play or pass, guys? <clears throat> the horse doesn't want it, apparently. Maybe he's part of the correct clue clan. <laughs> oh, God. The clue. No, nah, I'm not, I'm not going to go there. <laughs> play? The top answer is still up there. Let's hope play it is. Family got this. All right, Bractimus. Time for your guess. Give me your final answer, sir. Is that your final answer? Do 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 do. What you got, homie? Fancy, fancy. Our survey said. There it is. We found the Woo! most popular Horse. Where's the horse? All right. AM Mayhem, what would uh, you be horrified to discover missing? There are only four answers, so that's where it gets a little tricky. Your answer, sir. Crud? <laughs> Shoes? Okay. Okay, sure. Is that one of the ones we're still looking for? Shoes. Nope. All right. It isn't there. First strike. But you've still got this. I know it. Yes. Oh, I know. Name something you'd hate to discover was missing on the morning of your wedding. Um, I know. This should definitely be up there. I'll be surprised if it isn't. Oh, yes. Interesting answer. 
teeth. <laughs> yeah. If I woke up without my teeth, I'd be a little worried too. Son of a bitch, really? That's another strike. I thought for sure I had at least number four. Well, there's two Bojack. You're coming in clutch. The marriage license? All right. I thought about that for a second, but I didn't know how to phrase it. Marriage certificate, a oh, license, there it is. Yes, good answer. Okay, then. How about Let's see what the survey says. The pastor. Marriage license. Way to stay in the game. Yay. All right, AM. I need an Back answer. on you, the priest. That's what I thought, too, yeah. The pastor, priest, whatever. The prenup. <laughs> Wait, am I spelling it right? Answer accepted. Do we have it? Priest. Ah. Oh no, that strike three. Son of a bitch. We still aren't out. We, be about to we aren't out speed. yet. They're gonna put walrus. I know they're gonna put walrus. One answer will do it, and they can steal the round. Yeah, that is pretty lame. Name something you'd hate to Those are like all the essential things you need for a wedding, wedding. The very basic things. Alcohol. Probably alcohol. How can you miss the prenup? He went with prenup! I was joking! Survey says This dude's been married before. Prenup. Oh, we still win. Oh yeah, here we go. Waffle iron. <laughs> Chopsticks, jeez. Well, we only missed one answer. Let's hope it's the funny one. You're the funny one. Here comes number two. Lucky McCoy. Dress. Okay, I guess. How are those scores looking? I wouldn't be too worried personally, but... Only one round down. <laughs> There's still everything to play for. Wow. Wow. I'm not saying that, right? <laughs> What if I do this? See the wrinkles in my hand. Oh, come on! Here we go, the famous error that we always freaking 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 frack. Whatever. Okay, we gotta restart, guys. I'm not updating. You're just gonna update with more errors. Lame. At least it was in the beginning. We get a mulligan, you guys. We haven't had one of those in forever. Yeah, we haven't. Well, we haven't played this in a minute either, so I guess. Seeing as how I gotta wait for the game anyway. Make an adjustment here. Whoa, I'm actually on the screen a little better. Uh, camera. All right, hold on. Everything's kind of falling apart, literally. There you guys. There. Okay. Much better. I feel like I'm just enough off the camera that it's sort of weird. There. Now it's even worse, isn't it? <laughs> oh my god, it's not staying put! So the problem with this camera is I'm... I'm Liking just about everything about it, however, the cord on it is so stinking stiff that when I adjust it, it just kind of pops right back <laughs> to where it wants to be, not to where I want it to be. <sighs> like that. Y'all just saw it. I have to use a clip in order to keep it in place. Whatever, I'm not gonna mess it. Thought you liked it. To, I like it loose and sloppy. You know that. Wink. I almost said clothes. I think shoes might cover it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Anyway, whatever. Don't ask me about the stupid Ubisoft here. Okay. Never skip. All right. Whatever game. I don't get why you crash so much. It's such a simple game. <laughs> 
Alright, sorry about that, guys. We had a very... It was too climatic. The game couldn't handle us right out of the box. Now, I'm glad that happened sooner than later. That was literally the first question. Now, if we were, like, at the tail end of the game and it happened, <laughs> I'd be a little bit more pissed. Good evening, and welcome hey. to the Family Feud. Mulligan. Like, he just strolls out like people are going to praise him as a god. Did you see that? Hello, everyone. Bask in my presence, lucky for I am Lucky McCurry. Thank you for joining us here. Let's get things started by meeting our feuding families. We're so good, we only need three of us. They've got their feuding faces on. All set with some smooth grooves, it's the lead. Smooth groove? I like him. Great YouTube channel. Here's how it works. You and your family it's will sucky get to <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny, but it is. To play fast money for the chance to win Hi, I'm Sucky McCock, and welcome it's to my game. Time. Let's do this. All right. In a pseudo universe Let's somewhere else, <laughs> we played that game. Face -off. Who's playing this time? Get yourselves over here. Get your mean self out here, bitch. <laughs> Six answers is what we're looking for this time, folks. Go pop it on. When you have an answer to our survey, buzz in as fast as you can. Whoever finds the top answer first gets to decide if they want to play or pass. 100 people gave us an answer to this question. Name a product where bigger is considered... You got it? <laughs> Condoms! God, I don't know. Uh, bigger's better. Um... Mm -hmm. Um, of course I'm having like a brain fart right now. Um, right, bigger's better. Car, truck. Nice. Implants, dildo. Ooh, and TV's a good one. Say? Car. Boom! Answer number one. Decision time. Shall we play, play this one, you guys? Big American penis. I'm gonna play it. Fuck it. Playing. I'm making a call. All right, Broctimus. Got an answer for me? Am's throwing his answer out. How about you? Well, Am's throwing two answers out. He's gonna have to pick one. <laughs> Those are both actually really good answers. Aaron's okay. Sorry, Aaron. He's a uh, jack in your second answer there. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, those are both there. good. TV and house. House. There it is. Number. It's up there. Number four. You can jack me anytime. Ooh. You got That's what that gift sub was for, wasn't it? To warm them up. Warm you up. Excuse me, Aaron. All right, and you said TV. Do you want to stick with that? I think that's a great answer myself, but okay. TV it is. Yes. Let's see what the survey says. TV. All right, there it is. We're in the points. Yes. Hey, yeah. This is a little bit of a stretch, but it could be up there. Better. Horse. Well, is it a product though? There you go, fridge. Well, is it bad? I'm questioning my logic of is it a, uh, eh, I'm overthinking it. All right. Overthinking it. Is that one of the ones we're still looking for? Pool. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm questioning if pool is really a product. I mean, it is technically, I guess, but. You look like someone who's got a good guess for us. All right. Proctimus, jewelry. Oop. Oh. 
Okay, well. Jewelry. Jewelry. Nope. Do you want jewels or jewels? Jewel or jewels? Is that all that's really popping up? Oh, yeah. Diamond ring, there it is. That's a good one, Brack. That's a great one. Oh, okay. Is that one of the remaining answers? I thought it was that Diamond AM, but it wasn't ring. popping up at all. Diamond ring, you well, got it, bro. Uh, AM, can you snipe the last one? Time for your guess. Um. um. <laughs> Boom! Stereo fridge. Fridge could be, I guess. Stereo is kind of old at this point. Uh, what you got, AM? I'm kind of brain farting on this now. <laughs> Bed? Oh, yeah, okay, okay. That's a good one. I'd buy it. I like a big Understood. bed. I do like a big bed. There aren't many <laughs> answers left. Is it there? Bed. Come on. Ah. Oh, no. Shit. You struck out again. Two answers remain. Uh. Oh. I think I need a bigger box. Maybe boat. Sorry about that, boys. That was Brocket for first, not me. <laughs> Pizza? Food? Condoms? I'm still thinking condoms. Uh. It was Brock. I'm sorry. Right now, Aaron, hold on. I'm gonna put Bo. I doubt, uh. All right, yep. I, I do have a, something in my defense board. that time, AM. Boat. So on my screen right now, Broctomus is like a bright pink you're color text name, uh, for his name. And you are a slightly, you're like a salmon colored, like another all shade of pink. So it's on all pink on my chat right now. And I seen a guess and I was like, oh, that says, uh, yeah. So I admit it was Broctomus's answer, but to be fair, he did steal your answer. So fridge, if it's fridge, because AM did guess fridge. All right. That's not what we're looking for. Yeah, mine is gold for you. See, you don't have like a permanent one set, so it randomizes it for everybody. Because on my other screen here on my laptop, you're Let's actually a turquoise color. Show those missing answers. <laughs> it's, it's funny how Twitch Sixth does it. Answer? Bank account. That's not a product. We wanna see that three. is not a product. Steak. I was thinking food too, so uh, I'll I'll buy charge. steak, but bank account is not a product. The first points of the game are on the scoreboard. Wow. Oh, I've always wondered about that. I set mine to bright pink a long time ago. Yeah, bank account is dumb. It's not a product. <laughs> time to go head to head. It's the face. Yeah, I changed mine to my and green like day one <laughs> when I started Twitch. So. All right, Bojack. I'm gonna buzz you in, but you need to make my answer. <laughs> we have four to find on this one. Ready. Stand by your buzzers. Here we go. 100 people. We ask them the following. Name a good musical instrument to take up if you're mad at your neighbors. You buzzed in first. <laughs> okay, this is great. What you got? Horse! Horsey, horsey! So horse it is. Oh wait, no, you said uh, drums. That's good. 
Our survey said drum got to be number 1. Yep. And you can't do better than that. Top answer. Right, do we want to play or pass? Now here's the million dollar question. Play or pass? A little too late to the draw there, Lucky. What's your final answer, Rocco? I'd love to hear bagpipes if they were good at it. Hell yeah. You still awake? Are you gonna play or pass? Play it is. Play again? Okay. Hey, Jingler. What do you have for us? All right, AM Mayhem. Do you really want to go with bagpipes? I personally think that's a great answer, but is it general public dumb enough? Remember, they asked 100 people. These aren't correct answers. These are answers people gave. <laughs> bagpipes. All right, let's do it. Even if it's not up there, we know you're right. Yes. Survey said bagpipes. Yes! Dude! Fucking A! We've got two answers left on the board. Oh. I want to say either guitar or organ. Because if you had a full ass fucking organ in your house, the whole block's going to hear that shit. I'll stay simple, because this is what a hundred people would probably answer. A guinea pig? Yeah, let's play a guinea pig. That's your answer. Only a few answers left. Have you found one of them? Guitar. All right, we got to snipe that number two, fellas. Only six people? Yeah, they were the six Scottish people that were asked. <laughs> All right. We got the big ones out of the way. Trumpet? Trumpet's not bad. I almost thought about even like saxophone or something, but I guess a horn would work in general. You trumpet you. That's what you think, huh? That's what you think, huh? You're wrong, but whatever. Let's look anyway. Trumpet. Ah. Alright. Sorry, it wasn't up there. So I'm gonna have to. Q Mambo number five. A little bit of Erica in Mama. <laughs> Blue Name a good musical instrument to take up if you're mad at your neighbors. All right, AM. Snipe it again, brother. Harmonica. <laughs> okay, that's a D&D &D joke. I don't think it'll be up there personally, but I can put it in. You sniped bagpipes. I really shouldn't doubt it. Stop me if you don't really want to answer this. I'll type it in, though. Oh, there it is. Ha, not a D&D &D joke intent. Okay, we'll do it. Fuck it. You sniped bagpipes. Why not harmonica? Got I thought for sure it was a D&D &D reference. Is that the final answer? Go with it. Not sure what else. Ah. That's your second strike right there. Look sharp. Another strike and you lose control of this Cowbell. Sax, maybe. So I'm split between horn and organ. I know. <laughs> horn and organ. <laughs> One track mind, right? Um, I think general. Horn, organ, horn, organ, tuba, uh, tuba. Mm. Fuck it. Yeah. Fuck it. All righty then. Do we have it? Tuba. And Bro! Fucking A! A a mayhem needs to go on Family Feud. This round. All right, it's time for a score update. <laughs> Holy smokes, dude! One family's in the lead. The other. Well, Am on let's fire. Just say they're biding their time for the moment. How do I set the font color? Let me look. Oh, shoot. 
I think you click your name. Get ready to go full Nick Cage because it's time. Full for Nick Cage. I need a Hello. contestant from each family, please. <clears throat> I think what you do. Where is things? There are four answers you need to find. Time to take it to the next level with double points. We've got answers. So what I think you do, AM, I'm not 100% sure. Name something people keep a bottle of on the nightstand. Think you got something? What you got? AM, AM, real quick. We'll, we'll solve the color thing in a second, but... Name something people keep a bottle of on the nightstand. <laughs> Somebody type in the Beavis and Butthead emote. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Here we go. Let's see if you're right. Love a dub dub. Mouthwash. So, AM, in the chat, Day. click on Not your name, and it's either. Something like so chat settings or chat profile. There's a couple of them. Poke through through those two options, and you should find your color there. <clears throat> Sued. Let's see it. Soda. Sorry, but can't tell you 100% from where I'm at just because uh, I'm running through Streamlabs right now, so. Name something people keep a bottle of on the nightstand. This is your answer again. You're defending. What you got? <laughs> Shit, hey, the reload. Okay, name something. This is your defending. What else do people keep on the nightstand? Water? Okay. As soon as he said soda, I kind of came to the same response too. Good. Okay. Let's see if that's a correct answer. But anyway, um, click on your name in the chat, and there should be like user profile or user settings. I think there's two different options. Click on one or both of those. You should find it in one of those options there. It's hard for me to tell because I'm running chat through Streamlabs right now, and this stuff doesn't really pop up if I click on it. I gotta like be in a stream and chatting in order to look at it. I'm sure it's in your settings somewhere if you go into the deep settings, but that's the quicker way in my opinion. Um, do we play or pass, AM? Stuff on the uh, nightstand. Is it worth playing? I'll go with your answer. Pass and a pass from both teams. You've only got two options, play or pass. It ain't that. This is your big chance. I see the uh, make the please stumble through this. Give me an answer. The only other answer I really have is lotion. Hot water, I guess. They'll fuck it up. See if the yeah, they're going to put like tacos. Hot water bottle. Where he said water, that dumbass. Noise? That's a strike. Milk bonsai plant. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, it looks like you found it. You're blue now, AM. Yeah, you're blue on both screens. You totally found it. I want to see that answer. Ketchup. Ketchup? Ketchup. Yeah, because I keep a fucking tall bottle of ketchup next to me when I'm sleeping. Who knows if you need a shot of fucking hot dog water in the middle of the night. Medication makes sense now. Is that one of the ones we've got left? Lube. Yeah, Shanulu, we said that a little earlier. <laughs> okay, medication was a good answer. It's your turn to get throw rug. Here we go, throw rug. Perfume. That's what you're going with? I guess. Is that answer good enough? Perfume. What? This game is not over yet. I guess if you're looking for sexy time. 
Name something people keep a bottle of. All right, all right, all right. Stand. Penguins. Ah, there it is. Shoot, they actually may have gotten this. Survey says they probably got it. Lotion. Son of a dirty bitch. That's the final answer. <laughs> The scores. I have chapstick, but it's not a bottle and, it, and it's a tube. Oh. Clearly, it's mustard. <laughs> That's okay. They're barely ahead, as long as we don't flub the next round. I'm gonna need I've got a bad feeling about this. To join me up here. I like that little jig he does right before jumping up there. There's eight answers on the board this round. We're upping the ante again. All questions are now worth triple. Trips. We asked 100 people. Name something in your life you're happy with. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nice buzzing, Tex. <laughs> nice buzzing, Tex. Um, something in your life you're happy with. Um... I don't know. My home life is <clears throat> pretty good, I guess. Said with confidence. Triple Show nipple. Home. Nope. Son of a bitch. Of course, You're Lucky's wrong. home life isn't happy, so he wouldn't know. Let's see if we can get something on the board. <laughs> I was gonna say job, but I hate my fucking job, so I'm not gonna say that. You're happy with. <laughs> you can say it though. Pet? Got it. Come on, that's part of my home Let's life. Check the board and see oh, wait, he's, in there. he's over here. Pet. There's a lot of fucking answers for this oh, one. Pardon dear. my French. Have you got some feud for thought? Okay, I'm gonna steal Name something in your life you're happy with. Health. I like health. Job and spouse would be a lie. Health would not be. <laughs> I know I'm not answering for myself. You but sure there's eight that? answers. Could it be up there? Let's find out. Health. That's well, obviously Lucky for. doesn't know what being healthy is like either. What you go for? Name something in your life you're happy with. Video game console. Okay. I'm so happy with my video game answer. console. Video game console. Yeah. Oh, too bad. Okay. Here's the real happy. trick. Lucky's not happy with anything in life. Something in your life. We're so here like purgatory forever. Fine, fucking job. Everybody knows that's up there. I'm just being stubborn. I see where you're going with this. Eight answers and a lot of X's. Who did they interview? John. There. Six people like said they were happy with their job out of a hundred. <laughs> so what's the deal? Oh, we're passing the fuck out of this. We've already guessed some of our best guesses. Fuck that. Let's watch let's kick back and watch the Lees fuck this up. Let's see how that goes. Yeah, six out of a hundred are actually happy with their careers. Because I'm gonna need one. <laughs> Phone. An okay, I guess. They're happy with Lucky ketchup. They should have put ketchup in, right? Phone. Woo! Eh. All right, we got to think up a good retort. They're definitely going to fuck this up. So what's our retort? It's up to you now. Spouse, probably. So yeah, if they interviewed these people on the street and they were with their spouse, yeah, 99 people answered spouse. <laughs> I want to sleep in the bed tonight. Oh, I'm happy with my spouse. Name something in your life you're happy with. Oh, yeah. Diploma. Okay then. I'm happy with my cottage cheese. Diploma. There it is. And that's three strikes. Nice. Ho ho! Like my friend Al Capone used to say. 
Our other family has a chance to steal. <laughs> if you want to steal this round, you need to find me a missing answer. All right. Car kids and spouse are all awesome. Board, you'll steal that money in the bank. I'm gonna go with spouse though. That does seem like a, uh, if you caught a couple on the street, this is gonna be their answer like seven out of ten times at least. Yes, good answer. Nice. Let's check the board. Okay, spouse. that's all we needed. That's what we want. Well, gotta go find my sister. <laughs> I don't know. Random ashed one. Kids in car probably on there. Jewelry, there you go. Came in sixth place. Tablet. Tablet and phone didn't work. Fourth answer. Okay. Computer. Answer number three. Money. What was answer number two? Okay, I didn't think anybody was happy with that. Children. Children. Chinulu with kids. That tricky top answer. Car. Car, there it is. Woo! Let's see how the scores look. <laughs> what the fuck, you? <laughs> Stick around, folks. No one's reached the magic 300, so we get to play another round. <laughs> Lucky's like, so we get to play another round. I want to go home, but I'm here in this hell. With this horse headed man. Nobody has reached 300 points. We got to decide this game. Batten down the hatches. It's time for a Have we ever death. had a sudden death? I feel like with this is One the first time we've had a sudden team. death. Come down and join me here at the front. This round is worth 50 bazillion points. <laughs> for the points don't matter, right? <laughs> I think All we have. Okay, it's just been so long. For this survey, we're asking for the top answer only. Points are tripled. Whoever gets this answer wins the round. In our survey, we asked 100 people, name something Pinocchio might use to give himself a nose job. You're first on the buzzer. What? Yeah. What? Ooh, what? Okay, well. saying a saw we'll go a saw that's legit seesaw marjorie daw what in the hell kind of answer is that fucking a saw okay is it up there show me saw correct answer <laughs> There it is. AMAM a. A. sniped it again. Time to say so long to the leaves. Oh my god, Brock. Oh my god, don't work with that, Brock. Don't work with that. I, I know I hear you typing. What should we do now? Oh, to I know. Leaves. Let's play fast money. I need two people. <laughs> okay, Captain. Which of this plucky crew do you want to play fast money with? Pick wisely. Which of the plucky crew? Um, I'm voting AM. No offense, Brock, but AM sniped like freaking six answers here already. What about the other 46 people? <laughs> they were shot. You take it, Aaron. You're on fire. Yet? All right. Yeah, we're going AM. You're you're being. You've got voted in, buddy. Looks like we're all set. Let's go. I changed that name from Buddy though. <laughs> yeah, we'll put in like I'll fake Z. You five questions. You give me five answers. Try to think of the answers. Right, you know the rules, Am. Responses. Get more than two hundred points. Where did Buddy come from? It was the random name, but I never Ready? changed it. Clock. Name something you might see people push down the street. Push down the street. Uh, 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 um. Oh God, this one's kind of weird. Um, cart or er, cart. 
Name something you I'm not like looking at chat. In reach while you're driving your car. Name something I have to reach when you're driving your car. Um, something I well, you know. No. <laughs> a knife. Uh. Wait, you actually use a lot. Breath mints, but I don't feel like that'll be an answer. Whatever credit card, I guess. That's name something that's a bad answer. might take out before going to bed. Dentures, I guess. That seems like a kind of obvious answer. Name something people hate waiting for. Waiter. Name a button on the remote you wish worked on your spouse. <laughs> The change channel. That's all five. All right, give me your answers, Am. I don't look the chat for this stuff. So cart, yeah, stroller, phone. Ooh, stroller's good. All right, Am, what you got? Is a little more difficult. You'll answer the same five questions. Change channel. Not duplicate any answers we've had. If you do, you'll have to give it another guess. Let's start the clock. Name something you might see people push down the street. All right, AM. Um, what are we pushing down the street? The homeless? Stroller. All right, I liked homeless better, but whatever. Name something you like to have within reach while you're driving your car. My dick! <laughs> I'm so full of bullshit. Phone, okay. Phone is great. Phone is a way better answer than what I had. Name something a person might take out before going to bed. A dick! <laughs> Why? Why am I like this? Contacts is awesome. Contact lenses. Name something people hate waiting for. What do they wait, hate waiting for? I had another good one for this, but I'll see what you have. Doctor, all right. I was thinking traffic was another good answer too. Name a button on the remote you wish right. worked on your spouse. Eject. <laughs> power. <laughs> Volume power. Eject. Uh, Netflix. Wait. <laughs> That's it. All right. That's it. There's nothing more we can do now. It's time to bring out both contestants it's, and see how the scores came out. It's in God's hands now. Don't touch me with your freakishly First large up, hand. We wanted you to tell us. Name something you might see people push down the street. I had Your a couple answers? crappy answers, Rock. I don't know. These answers are AM's answers good. are pretty point, though. Aha. That's a tough Ooh, answer. Okay. Great job. Ooh, stroller's top answer. Two, we asked, name something you like to have within reach while My you're dude. driving your car. And your answers? How many people said those answers? Yeah, all right. Oh, that's a shame. We couldn't get points for both answers. Yeah, I panicked. You want to know the top answer? Dick. Water. Okay. Third question, right? It was... Name something a person might take out before going to bed. This is what you said. That's two strong answers yeah, right Yeah, these there. are both good. You only need a few more points. Only four for contacts? Number Holy four. smokes. How many old people Name were part of that? Hate waiting for. Survey. These were your answers. Did either of these get any big points? Yeah. You're so okay, close. whatever. You go to a restaurant once in your goddamn life, that Lucky. Given you the top points. Yeah, whatever. The okay. Last question. Name a button on the remote you wish worked on your spouse. You answered. You better get more than 30. If you pull this off and get 200 points, you'll win the jackpot. Woo! All right. <laughs> You won the jackpot! 
All right, where are we spending our money, boys? Take care of yourself. Good night. I'm taking mine and getting sushi. <laughs> no, that would irk Brock. <laughs> yeah. I love you. <laughs> awesome. Starring Clam Slapper. All right, shall we rematch the Lee family? Let's do it. All right, we're having a rematch. Oh, bedtime. Oh, okay. Let me slip out. <laughs> on up for a late night edition of Family Feud. Late night Feud. edition of Family Feud. All right, hold on. Return to main menu. Yes. All right. AM Mayhem, thank you so much for your contributions tonight. I really appreciate you because you sniped the hell out of some of those. <laughs> Holy shit. That was kind of a long game. I actually enjoyed it. Um, I mean, we did have that stumble there of the error but <laughs> in the beginning, but hey, it is what it is. But yeah, have yourself a great night, man. Um, I don't know if I'm going to see you this weekend. Uh, you probably got plans, question mark? I don't know. You're more than welcome to come with us down to the avenue for the Halloween thing, but <laughs> I enjoy the long game, too. <laughs> but yeah, um, we're probably going to head down. I'd like to be down there by... 637 but I mean you can come whenever if you'd like to more than welcome to I understand if not though but have fun at the wedding uh that's in a few weeks but yeah um I got a message actually if all goes well okay cool hold on I'm, I'm actively updating the stuff right as we go so it looks like maybe in two weeks we might be able to play. Okay, cool. So uh, the DM who on the 22nd was going to be busy, it sounds like he might not be busy now. So we might be able to play D&D in a couple of weeks. But on the 29th, yeah. That might be, yeah. We'll see. Again, I'm planning way so far ahead. I'm excited for you to go to this wedding and jump the gun. He was just at one, too. Hey, ma'am's Mr. Popular here. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, have a great night, man. I'll see you next time. Um, We'll be back Wednesday at our normal time, other than the D&D &D stuff. But uh, I'm going to start a new game then. I'm debating if I want to do the long play or if I want to do squeeze one more game in that I've been kind of wanting to play. But I'll decide later on. So have a great night later, dude. All right. Yeah, we'll do another. Breakfast, you got one more, you said. I take it you're probably in the office tomorrow. I know it's an off night for me to be streaming as well. But I wanted to get something in for you guys. You're in? You're in. Alright, let's do it. Hello. Chihuahua and horse. Um, I'll give... I was in today and have gone all day on three and a half hours of sleep. Woof! I get you if you're tired. <laughs> um, I don't know how long... I got about five hours last night. Not like trying to brag or anything I guess but <laughs> alright chat if anybody else wants in I'll give you all about 30 seconds to uh, pipe up uh, games of this usually last 20 to 30 minutes typically all I need you to do is when it's your turn on screen give me answers but uh five is a good number yeah I guess <laughs> I'm just looking forward to getting the full eight tomorrow well tonight after stream and whatnot but but uh, yeah, if anybody out there lurking wants to play and has got about a half an hour, I'll plug you into the game, but uh, I'll give you a few more seconds here to pipe up. If not, that's fine. Me and Brock will face the leaves. <laughs> All right. One more sip and then we're going. All right. Three, two, one, boom. Do it. I know you're never gonna want to move away from your favorite family in the world. Honestly, I think I like easy mode because you know, now, fuck the challenge. The challenge is getting around Lucky's bullshit. It's time for but it's funny to watch them struggle to answer these. Like, yeah, you get the random ass answers. Like, really? <laughs> I feel like our opponent more is Lucky than the other family. <laughs> Thanks so much for coming here to the feud.
guess what? We've got two families ready to play. Like we haven't had before. Oh, by the way, the um. Folks are looking lean and mean. Yeah, they are. <laughs> um, if you guys like the Jackass crew at all, they were recently on Family Feud, and it is on YouTube, and it is hilarious as shit. I highly recommend going and watching it when you get some time. It's about 45 minutes long, roughly, I think. But yeah, you got everybody's on there. It's some of the new crew, a lot of the old guys are on there. If you like Jackass or those guys at all, totally recommend watching it. It's super funny. Hell, when he's going through and like introducing both sides, like Let's even that itself is just worth round. watching. Ketchup as a nightstand item is the reason we play the Lee family. <laughs> You're not wrong. You're not wrong. I'm surprised you didn't say something awful. We've got four answers to find. Whatever. <laughs> say like soy sauce. I'm gonna ask you a question. And you need to buzz in first to answer. Uh, I'm bad. If you can find That's what's awful. hiding behind the top slot. You get to choose if your family I'm plays nasty. the round Send me out or the gives it a pass. We got 100 people to answer the following question. We got 100 people. Name something people often forget to close. Fast fingers, my friend. Feeling often confident? forget to close. Doors, windows. Pocket window, I guess. Yes. Did any of our 100 people say it? Window. Oh, so sorry. Only Not like there. literally the what most basic of fucking answers that Name anyone in this green earth can give. Clothes. <laughs> Drawers. All right. Oh. Do we have a right answer? God. Drawers. Moon. Fuck me. We found an answer. The decision is you play or pass. Not literally, but metaphorically. Rejoin your family and let's get started. Good. Take the goddamn answer. I bet you've got a great answer for us. Oh. Fucking cucumber. Say it. Zipper. Oh, okay. Is that answer up there? Zipper. It's there. I never forget to close that because you never need it closed. Mm. Two more answers up there. What do you think? Oh. Brain. Yeah. Yeah. How do you forget to close your eyes? What the Is fuck? Let's hope so. I'll be mad if that's up there. Eyes. <laughs> you failed to find an answer, which means you get your first strike of the round. See, I think I'm bad with the race of shit, and then Brock chimes in. Name something people often forget to close. I said windows because it could have been physical windows or like windows windows, like a computer. Like you have an open window in the background. You forget to close it. Okay, people. Let's be careful here. You can still do it. Close your mouth. All right, you're doing well. There's only two answers left. This dude's my favorite of the Lee family. He looks so goddamn clueless every time. Feeling lucky? Lid. <laughs> Let's take a look. Grandpa has no ID. He's got the Alzheimer's. They just needed to fill a seat. That's your third strike, folks. The other door has to be the answer. If door is not up here, I don't know. I can't make any idle threats. I got none. I'd just be dumbfounded, I guess. You could steal these points and give yourselves a great chance. That's, a good answer. That's good. Time to find out if it's up there. Door. Oh, thank God. You've cracked it. You've cracked the case. <laughs> the sky is... Not thunder, but okay. <laughs> if the door isn't up there, you have to burn this cart. Mouth. Oh. Yeah, mouth. I said mouth. Look at that. Let's see where we're at. That'd be tricky, Brock, because this is a digital copy of the game. We've got so much fun left to have here. Yeah, I said mouth, right? Yeah. 
Ba -ba Are you ready for another face-off? Someone from each family, get up here and play. <laughs> no cart to burn then, so you're good. <laughs> Top four answers up on the board. Get ready to buzz in. We asked a hundred people the following. Name an occupation in which you'd worry about leaks. You're in first. Movies, video games, uh, books. Um, oh wait, probably not that kind. <laughs> Urologist? <laughs> no, you want the leaks, right? Is that what you really want? Remember, you gotta answer like a stupid American. There we go, plumber. Great answer. Ah, uh, yes. Is it up there? Plumber. Well, if Aaron was, were still here, he'd say HVAC installer. <laughs> This is your answer, Brock, but I'm going to tell you right now, I got nothing. Pool installer? Uh, HVAC installer? Uh, movies? Video game? <laughs> you got wax in your ears or something? He's tell a horse, of course he does. Do you want to play your pass, Brock? Uh, I just, yeah, I was going to say, I'll just worry. I don't think I got much on this one. We're passing to you. This is your shot. WikiLeaks? I don't know. Yeah, we already have the top answer at 66. You You're right. It's going to be a bunch of irrelevant bullshit, isn't it? Politician. <laughs> Could it be there? These morons won't get it. There it is. Balloon sculpture artist. Just two answers left to find. No, that one actually makes sense. They wouldn't get that. Data entry? <laughs> Maybe they will. Data <laughs> entry. Okay, woo! Politician was loose, but it is a decent answer. Give them that. There's two answers still up there. What do you got for me? <laughs> Gas worker. Ah! Is that one of the ones we're still? That might be. For? That's yeah. good. Oh, dude, Grandpa You're knew what really he was good. talking about this time. Uh, okay. He had a moment of clarity with his dementia kicking out. Name an occupation in which you'd worry about oh. leaks. It works, but I never would send it if I risk. Yeah. yeah. A banker. Alrighty then. Is it there? Yeah. Banker. Do we have uh -oh. something to respond with? Family better get ready. Oops. Author, director, game dev, stuff like that. Yeah. Just one answer left. <laughs> Blimp driver? <laughs> Sailor. Oh, fuck. That's it. That's it. Sailor. Shit. Shit. I knew it. You found all the answers. Oh well, it's round one. 89 points is fucking spit in the bucket. That's okay. What are those scores doing? No! Top of the scoreboard. It's okay. First round is just warm up. At at worst. I got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> it's time for a face off. I'm gonna need Dang one it, person Bobby. from each family to join me right now. <laughs> There's six answers up there. Interested in doubling your money? Because now everything is worth twice as much. Okay, see? We asked 100 people this question. Name a place where you'd see a lot of dogs in like a flash. What do you think? Oh, yeah. It's worth a shot. It Our better be. Says, Bet. The yes, fucking so fifth there, answer? Not the top answer. Okay, then. Tells me you've got the top answer.
Why? Why? Don't say it, Brock. Don't say it. <laughs> Don't say it. The racetrack. Oh, you're. Is it on the board? Racetrack. God damn it, Brock! You said it. That's incorrect. <laughs> so, what are you gonna do here? Play or pass? What do you think, Brack? Play or pass? I can go either way on this, I guess. Play? All right. Okay, you're gonna Let's play. try it. Let's see what happens. All right, this is your answer. Hey there. Looks like it's your turn. Okay. What you got? The part answer accepted. Our survey said Park. What is the number Excellent one fucking job. answer? Yeah. Oh, nice. It's your go. What do you think? This is gonna be a really, really, really retarded answer. But I legitimately think it would probably be one. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, let's try it. Gold the Deadpool! Welcome in, buddy! Dog show! Alright, it was on nice there! Job, I thought it was gonna be too dumb answer. of an answer. Welcome in, Gold Deadpool! Nice to see you, buddy! Name a place How you doing? See a lot of dogs. The shelter! Oh, that's a good answer. Didn't even think about that. Sure thing. Did anyone in the survey say this? Shelter. Number one answer. Number one answer. There's only two answers left on the board. Tired got woken up after an hour of sleeping. We're all sleep deprived, dude. Prax going three and a half hours on five. Uh, <laughs> we should just call this the Insomniac Channel. The dog show part. Oh, you know what? That's a good answer. Yeah. That's what you're going with? Heaven. Oh, Shanulu got answers? dark. Home. Ah. Okay. That's your first strike. Two more and you're done. Oh. All dogs go to heaven, so there must be a lot of dogs the there. The feud chain. The feud chain. About to start working in a few days after my first month in Michigan. Nice. Should have uh, hopefully had a relatively nice month here in Michigan, but uh, if you don't mind, uh, what'd you wind up finding for a job? The pound we did shelter. That was a, the number one answer, actually, Gold Deadpool. Interesting answer. Let's see if it's there. Beach. Ah, son of a gun. Right. Another strike. Burger King. I get free Name food 17 an hour. That's not bad, dogs. bro. The food alone makes up for it. I work in a restaurant too, and like getting a free lunch every day. That's kind of a lot. It adds up fast. Hmm. How about. Ah, you guys got so many good answers already. I always see dogs at the beach, right? Oh god, what else? Um I'm drawing a blank. Fuck, I don't know. I got nothing. I got absolutely nothing. With Sorry, this is gonna be third strike and or whatever. What did our survey say? Store. Yeah. I got nothing. That's strike three. Dogs are fucking banned everywhere anymore. Fifty percent off when you're not working, dude. All the French fries. 
I would abuse the crap out of that for fries. Okay, if the answer is there, you'll steal the points. If not, they go to the other side of the stage. Buckingham Palace? What in the actual ever living? Buckingham Palace. <laughs> no. Buckingham Palace. <laughs> oh my God. It's time to take a look at what we didn't. Dog find. Perk Perk was up there. Dil What's Golden. number cool. six? Pet shop. Here comes number two. I said store. Kennel. Whatever. Here's oh my God, Kennel. So Holy moly, we've got ourselves a battle here. A new. Holy family. moly. I know. I said store. The Queen love Cory, but it's a lot of dogs, not well-known dogs. Like, what? <laughs> I, I get it. No, I get it, but... Get your game you thought kind of... <laughs> because it's time for the face-off. See, I want to say it's bullshit, but that is a legitimate answer, I guess. Because when I think kennel, I kind of think shelter, too. But I, they are different things, so... That one I'll concede, too, but pet store, I said store. I'm going to need six answers, friends. All right. Whatever. All right now. It's when I said pound. I thought kennel. Oh, I see, I see the now. I see now. Point values are tripled. Triple. All right, horse. People for this question. If you can't be beautiful, what would you like to be instead? Go for it. Proctimus. You are beautiful, but what's your secondary trait? <laughs> yeah, I would have thought kennel and shelter are the same, but I can see it. I guess yeah. Smart. Okay. Are you sure about that? Let's see what the survey says. Smart. Superb. Do you want to play or play your pass, pass, bro? Play or pass. Horse. Play. Looks like you're going for a clean sweep. Keep it up. I'm going to need a guess from you. Uh. <laughs> I thought you guys would love that. Rich, Woo! You got it. <laughs> I'm gonna need your guess. Shit. Uh... All right, Broctimus. You said healthy. You want to stick with that one? That's a pretty good one. You want healthy, bro? Healthy, it is. I see where you're Horse. going with this. Let's run with it. That'll Boom. Be. That'll do. Ah. I'm going to eat fries. Oh, you you're making me jealous. I kind of want to get like fries now. It's almost midnight. I still got time, technically. I'm going to say probably strong. We have an answer. There aren't many answers left. Is it there? Strong. Yes. Fit. Very nice. Yes. Good. Have you got something for us? Yeah. Athletic. Ah, uh, that might be fit, Brock, but I'll go with it if you want.
that's what you want. Whoops. Not up there, yeah. You got something else? Sexy. But that is that beautiful or not? Famous. Ooh. Good call, Brock. Sexy might be considered beautiful. I don't know. Ah, dude, that was a good answer. So you've earned yourself a strike. And now it's your guess. Oh. Let's play to his ego. Yeah, a good answer. Okay then. Survey said. Lucky. Damn it! That was a good answer Don't too. Come on. Our other family need to get ready to steal. Kind. Oh no. Okay. There's only two answers left. I see it. There. I totally see it. Oh. All right, horse. Last strike. How about this? This is kind of political. <laughs> Little bit political, right? What you got for me, Brack? Let's go with nice, okay. Great answer. Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> It was up there! Gold Deadpool! You sniper! If you can't be beautiful, what would you like to be instead? Um, skinny fit. fit was already up there. Fit was answered. You know what? Famous didn't work, but how about this? That's not up there great. Pong. <laughs> Charismatic. Kind. Fuck it. Fuck it. I'll go with goalie. Sexy's not up there, but neither was my answer. Okay. Is that the popular and famous are the same? Board? Yeah, skinny's the same as fit. Uh, I feel like. Oh no! Strike three. We have fit and healthy. Oh, that that kind of covers all of that too. I feel like, out. but lucky's bullshit. Who knows? All right. They're going to put trash can, so we're okay. We're safe. Here's your chance. You can do it. Yes. Let's see if you're right. Successful. All right. That's not All right. That was a great answer. I hate to admit. Happy. Ooh, Shanulu, dude. That was it. You knew that, didn't you? That was well, it. We only missed one answer. Let's hope it's the funny one. I Number think Shanula three. got it. Happy. Shanula got it. Son of a bitch. And we finally run out. Answer of thirty seconds quicker. So <laughs> no, I'm kidding, scores? man. That was great, dude. Good Can last thought. That was it. But I think we we're okay. <laughs> Only half paying attention. Oh, oh, yeah, half now paying attention. <laughs> oh, God. Are you ready to play fast money? Fast money? Ready. You're going to go first. 
I'm going to ask wow. five survey questions. That was kind of unceremonious, <laughs> but okay. If you and your teammate can score more than 200 points, you'll win the jackpot. All right. Not looking at chat. Okay. Start the clock. I don't want to take anybody's answer. Most people would fail a lie detector test when asked if they've ever cheated on what? Don't fail. Hold on. What test? Does it say spouse? But I would like to be a little optimistic and think not everybody cheats. Even though it's bullshit I had to go through. Instead of apples, what might people bob for at a billionaire's Halloween party? Billionaire's Halloween party. Fucking, I don't know. This is kind of a weird ass question. Fuck it, cash. Name something you see that makes you realize it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. I like Christmas in December. I hate Christmas outside of December. Name something I absolutely hate the music, though. That might be the color red. A woman owns that might be the color red. Okay. Um. Nah. Nah. Name something of yours that might get cut off. Nah. Cut off. We're done. <laughs> Balls, We're panties, oops. <laughs> Drug test, spouse, finger. <laughs> Going second is a little tougher. I'm gonna ask you the same All right, five Rock. questions. Let's lock Don't them down, buddy. Any answers? Because <laughs> if you do, I'll need another one. Your time starts now. Most people would fail a lie detector test when asked if they've ever cheated on what? That's you, Brock. What you got? Oh, okay. Instead of apples. What might people bob for at a billionaire? Don't ask the horse to bob for anything other than apples. Come on. This is rude. What are you going to bob for at a millionaire's house, Brock? Spouse. <laughs> you can't use the same answer twice. What you bobbing for, Brock? Bob for me. Ooh. <laughs> Car keys. <laughs> is your uh, inner league coming out there, Brock? I'll admit this is kind of a weird question. Name something you see that makes you realize it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Mariah Carey. Horse! <laughs> she got for the christmas answer commercials i've heard pears are something people bob for that is not wrong commercial name something a woman owns that might be the color red what does a woman own that might be the color red horse my bank account <laughs> Sweater. Name something of yours that might get cut off. This is the gotcha question. What you 
got. Uh, Brock? Penis? Sorry. <laughs> we have all the answers. Now it all comes down to this. Right, let's get back here on stage and see how you both did. <laughs> My pee, I mean finger. <laughs> Your lower finger, right? For starters, we asked. Most people would fail a lie detector test when asked if they've ever cheated on... Why does he feel the need what? to touch me every so time? here's what you said. These two are looking good. Hey, we've got a top sweet. Answer. Next up, we asked. Instead of apples, what might people bob? Billionaire pray has to be something weird Halloween and expensive. Party. Yeah, you're you right. Said. Our survey says. <clears throat> yeah. What? Number one answer. What? On our next question, I was kind of fucking around, but okay. Name something you see that makes you realize <laughs> it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Let's remind everyone what you said. Those look like some mighty fine answers. <laughs> look at McCoy. Nice. So close. Jesus Christ. More points than you there. The next question. Name something a woman owns that might be the color Music? red. Music? Ooh. Here's what you said. Ooh, that would have been good. How many of our 100 people said these? Take a deep Whee! breath. You just need a few more points. <laughs> Brock! I'm sorry, Underwear. Brock. Underwear? Well, that was our top That's answer. disgusting, Lockie. Get the and hell out of here. question. Name something of yours that might get cut off. Shut this is up! our answer. Ah! This is for all the marbles. Fucking carried it! Woo! This is the big one. The car is all yours. Yeah, it's all mine, Brock. You're a horse. You can freaking ride yourself. That's what I said. Yeah, Gold Deadpool did say panties. He wasn't wrong. He totally said panties. Yeah, horse. This is Lucky McCoy. Thanking you oh, so much. oh shit! See you next time. Woo! Clam slapper wins. Woo! <laughs> oh, son of a bitch! That was freaking entertaining. I blame it on the three point five hours of sleep. <laughs> hey, you know it worked. I wish I came early. <laughs> All right. On that pathetic attempt, I'm going to sign off. That's what she said. <laughs> All right. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to play one game of Wheel of Fortune to sign off for the night. And then I'm going to go myself because I'm also sleep deprived. And the tea has been wearing off for a while now. So, Proctimus Prime, you have yourself a great night. Thank you for your attempts. Nonetheless, we still came out on top. Them damn Lees haven't won a round tonight. Let's do a quick round of Wheel of Fortune, and then I'll be ready to end for the night. We're, we're, we're doing so much fun right now. I, I hate to end it abruptly, so we'll squeeze a wheel in. Fortune. Sure, update. Lows. Thanks for fun stream, enjoy the day off. Take care, gents. Just take the shot of whiskey, it'll wake you up. Uh, I kind of been chugging rum here, but... <laughs> right? Well, thank you, Bractimus, for the gift subs, the resub, the uh, company tonight. <laughs> the pretty hilarious Lee level answers. <laughs> Wait, I didn't mean to slap you like that, I'm sorry. <laughs> but thank you so much, Brack. Um, I will see you, we'll be back. I'll be, uh, I keep saying we, I'll be back next Wednesday. We're going to start a new game one way or the other, but I'll decide that game closer to the actual day. So have a great night, buddy. We're going to play the wheel for Shinulu here, and then I'm going to head to bed myself, I think. Slap me harder. <laughs> Ch -ch 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 -ch.
Awesome. I don't care about the Ubisoft Club. Off chick, let's do it. Normal. There are only six different puzzle categories 30 years ago, now there are 46. I found out that one shouldn't cheat a lot on Skyrim yesterday. Oh, how do you figure? Is it when the giant hits you? Downward and ends up smashing you freaking forty stories in the Looks like a nice crowd tonight, doesn't it? Good to see so many. There's good old Pat C. Jack and Van Oh well. Thank you for joining us today. Your outfit looks quite interesting. You must have <laughs> visited interest. the customization menu. It says here, well, it, it doesn't say much. Why don't you tell us about yourself? Holy crap. Hmm. That girl well, reminds me of somebody I know. <laughs> Not her, I'll but take the one that before as Caitlin. A great. I'm sure you're ready to get started. This is our one. I did the complete all quest right? command the and it crashed my PC. Living <laughs> After 30 minutes of running the command. God, how many did you complete, dude? Living thing. Are you ready to solve contestant number one? West Indian manatee. I think is what I'm gonna roll with. Round for two thousand dollars. I didn't mean to hit boo, but whatever. We'll roll with it. <laughs> two hundred or four hundred? Good God, bruh! Family. Contestant number three. Your chance to solve. I don't know this one at all. Bag and tiny. No, I don't know that. Contestant number two. Your chance to I solve. Nothing. Tub and tiny daily. Why don't you go Tom or Tim? Oh, Jesus. What is it, chat? Tom or Tim? I don't literally know anything about these people. Tim? No idea. Because Tom, Tim. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm going to say Tom. Because <laughs> it's my name. Oh, okay. Well, fuck it. We'll go Tim then. It was Tim! Looks like a few lucky contestants are here and ready to win nice. some money. Shall we see how lucky they are? Shall we go ahead and start the round? The category oh, is... Oh, lucky McCoy, I mean Contestant lucky... number one, go ahead and take the first spin. Okay, right on. 200, Jesus, dude. I, I, hard to wrap my brain around that. Okay, um, spin. Fuck it. Well, unfortunately, there are no S's. What a way to start! Almost there. Eight hundred. We have one C. It finally is starting the rain now. Good job. Keep that going. And now I might run the command way. again and see what happens. Bonkers, dude. 800. Will we get I'm gonna eventually play Skyrim for the stream, but I'm not gonna lie. I think I'm gonna try the VR version. We kind of dicked around with that a little bit like a year ago or so. It was a lot of fun. I just gotta get used to the controllers because they're not what I expected them to be. But I think it would be fun to mess around with Skyrim and VR for stream. I mean, it probably won't be a complete playthrough or anything, but... But until I stop having fun with it, at least. Oh, 
I'll admit it was fun in VR because you could totally just do this. Like, flick your wrist and you would attack like fucking crazy. Do we have Pardon my French. Fukan. No, I'm sorry. Wait, French. Fukan. Right, anyway, um... Chimichangas? Uh, and Grog? Seven hundred. We have one team. Not bad. We've got quite a bit of money now. That's money. I'm thinking R. Yes, we have some R's. A little bit of money should help you along now. And see if the command pairs. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna do the N. Anything that ends in G, you pretty much can guarantee the N will be in there. Grinder and nutmeg? Just make Fuck! I'm I was gonna follow you, Shadu. That sounds legit. If you'd like to buy a vowel, you That's okay. Maybe the computer won't be smart enough. God, she looks just like somebody I know. Buy a vowel. Yes, we have some. That almost bothers me. <laughs> Plus, she's like the freaking good version of the character that I made. <laughs> Got the chick there. Six hundred. Yes, we have some. <laughs> they will get it. Good job. Keep that going, and you'll be heading home a winner tonight. Are you ready to solve? And yep, they are. Two. Damn it. You done sniped it before anybody else could. Wow, that is incredible. How did you come up with that? <laughs> we don't want to keep our contestants waiting any wow, longer. Wow, you really so pulled that out of your ass, again. Caitlin. Let's get this round started. The category is, what are you doing? <laughs> Contestant you number doing? two, why don't you go ahead and take the first spin? Six hundred. Yes, we have some ends. I guess you'll be paying for dinner tonight. You can certainly buy a vowel. I'm sorry, there are none on the board. Ooh. Shit. Yes, we have some jeans. Getting. A oh, oh shit! Bankrupt is always a painful one. Getting a something, something. Ooh, the sea tree. Yes, we have some tea. Yeah. Getting a new occupation? A new... Ooh, that's good, bruh. That's not bad, Shanulu. We're going to France, Bye. Shanulu! No, N was already gone. Occupation can't work. But a new definitely does. One W. Go ahead. Pick up that. We're going to France, new. <clears throat> Getting a new 
buy a vowel. You can certainly buy a vowel. What would you like? Yes, we have some E's. Ah, that didn't do too much. <clears throat> Something time? No, tea was already just. 800. We have one S. Good job. Keep that going. You'll be heading home a winner tonight. Tiv. Stiv. Certainly buy a vowel. What would you like? Yes, we have some A's. Past? No, not past time. Damn it. Something time? Are you? Objective? No, the S is in there. Get another if vowel. If you'd like to buy a Yes, we have some I's. Past? No. Getting a new, not waistline. <laughs> Son of a gun, man. It's like, I feel like we're so close. It's kind of close. Oh! oh, 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 oh. I gotta play it. You hit big with thirty five hundred dollars. Yes, X. X. Unfortunately, there are two words. Holy shit. Will we get any help on this? Okay, okay, okay. Getting a new... Jesus Christ. Why don't you go ahead and tell us the answer? Whew. All right. Wow. I am speechless. Did you just pull that out of thin air? <laughs> You're here at the right time as it's time for the prize round. All right. Later, we'll yeah, hairstyle. on top of the cash. The that was close. Is landmark. Landmark. Contestant number right. three, you're right. up first, so take a spin. Doodly -doo. Oh! -ho! You hit big with thirty-five hundred dollars. We have one G. Holy hell! That's a lot of money you won That's there. That's a lot of fucking letters. Pardon my like French again. Yes, we have some. We're going to France. I'm speaking a lot of French tonight. Eight hundred. Unfortunately, there are none on the board. I'm sorry. Oh, 
500. If there are no S's in this, we can just quit right now. We have one S. That's a lot of money. Okay. You just contradict me. Say down again like crazy, crazy MF. Wow. Yeah, I'm talking about you. We have one team. Go ahead and pick up that wild card. Don't forget you have that wild card. Would you like to use it? Get out of there. Ooh, that was close. We have one R. Just one of these at a time. Don't Holy go and crap. spend all that at once now. Don't forget you have that wild card. Fuck you wild like to card. use it. What it do? Yes, we have some ends. That's a fair bit of cash you picked up. And Seven hundred. We have one. Well, that is a healthy amount to add to your winnings tonight. Positive thoughts now. That works. That works. That's too bad. Next contestant, it's your turn. With the free play, you've got a second chance at this. Yes, we have some Fs. Okay. Home That's of... a fair bit of cash you picked up. And home of something? Ah, shit, she's getting loaded. 900. In House of Fame? No, we don't seem to have any of those. Museum and home, no. Museum and Don't something and spend of fame. All at once now. Hand of fate. <laughs> Hall of Fame. Hall of Fame, yes. Museum and Hall of Fame. Figure? Gotta figure out which museum, yeah. Let's hope we don't get bankrupts. Stand that L next. National. Oh, national something. Yeah, okay. Oh, 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 God. Uh, uh, it was the same Bankrupt card. Is always a painful one. It was the same card. National. Big new state? No. With the free play, you've got a second chance at this. Yes, we have some L's. I guess you'll be paying for dinner tonight. Girl, something you girl? We got the money. Yes, we have some E's.
If you'd like to buy a vowel, yes, we have some aids. This one. So we get some lucky spins like loose. Oh, no. Just didn't make it this time. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's like I blew all that money on vowels. <laughs> you get half a card. We have one B. Wow, good job. Hang on tight and that car could be yours. Sure, you can buy a vowel. Yes, we have some O's. Cowgirl, is that a thing? We're running out of letters. I know. Contestant number it's, three. It's your chance. Gotta be. It was. I've never in my life heard of that. Okay then. Wow, you made that look easy. Congratulations, you're going to Italy. Italy, huh? Come with us on a trip to Italy well, and experience son of a the bitch. warm and sunny Mediterranean climate. Got us with the, the National Cowgirl Museum and, and Hall of Fame. It's Never heard of that. You got obscure puzzles. Dollars. Yeah, holy shit. Get smokes. ready for the toss-up. The category on this one is what are you doing? What are you doing? Dicks out for Harambe. Got it. Watching. It I'm gonna hit like it. You're ready I to feel like somebody else is going. Number one. Reaching a dead end. Something a dead reaching a dead end. I'll go with that. Yeah. Thank you, Shinulu, for the assist. Cool. Thank you, Shinulu. Let's go ahead and start the round. The category is people. People. Oh, that was it. I'm going to give the wheel another spin. Could have just gone with what we were doing, but okay. Uh, that's a long fucking string of letters. Yes, we have some S's. You've got some money, and that should help you out. Contestant number one, would you like to solve? Yeah. Will we get any Super califragilistic XP out of luck. We have one R. Great job. That's quite a bit of cash in your pocket now. Contestant number three, would you like to solve? Yes, we have some N's. Yeah, we'd love to solve. Well, that is a healthy amount. That is a healthy amount. Tonight. Thank you. Contestant number one, your chance to solve. Something ING again? Unfortunately, there are none on the board. No V's? <laughs> okay. We have one you. Son of a bitch, this is long. Contestant number three, your chance to solve. We have one G. Great job. That's quite a bit of cash in your pocket now. Contestant number one, would you like to solve? See, that's the thing. I don't know any letters, so I had to kind of guess the G. 
I can't solve the puzzle, I'm just kind of figuring out what letters might work. Yeah. We have one F. I see what you mean. Not bad. You've I got just quite a bit of money now. Contestant it's a number complete two, random would you like to solve? Professionals? We have one E. Okay, something something professionals. Contestant number three, your chance to solve. Yeah, professionals. Sorry, time is up. Will we get any help on this? It I seems got we're nothing out of for that first. We have one D. I guess you'll be paying for dinner tonight. Contestant number three, would you like oh, to solve? No. Outstanding professionals. Dude, I'll go with it. That might be yes, it. Yes, we have some O's. Yeah, it was. You're right. You're right. We're doing it. Thank you, Shanulu. I was severely stumped on that one. Number one, your chance to solve. Outstanding, Shinulu. Woo! If it wasn't for that, bro, let's get started. We wouldn't be hitting the, the bonus, bonus round. round. I'll hit your bonus round. Woo! Promise. E. Would you follow me over here, please? On the map. I'll throw R, S, T, L, N, and E up on the board as always. Damn, that was generous. On the map. Could we have three consonants and a vowel, please? Yeah. I was pretty sure you were going to get that one. Okay. Do CMG O. Uh, yeah, sorry that came through Time a little is late. Short, so get ready to solve. I'm terrible with geography, so the tan peninsula. What you got? I know you gotta know this one more than I do. Yucatan, yeah. See, I don't think I would have gotten it. It's in Mexico, yeah. I will admit I've heard of it before, but I don't think I would ever in a million years guess it. Yeah, Yucatan. Thank you, Shanulu. That definitely would have been a goose egg for me. Wow, you won the Peninsula bonus makes round. sense, but is... awesome. Thank you, Shanulu. Woo! Fifty-three. Yeah. 
We get a jacket, a new scene, and what is that? A haircut or the shades? <laughs> I don't know. Woo! 53, 54 grand just about. Half of that after taxes. <laughs> We're going to Japan! Oh wait, no we aren't. We can use these next time. Oh, okay. I'm off tonight, catch you later. Yeah, Shanulu, I think I'm gonna end there to be honest myself. I hit that wall about an hour ago, but I kept going because I've been having a lot of fun with you guys. But uh, yeah. Alright. <laughs> yeah, guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead and head off for the night. Thank you so much for everybody coming on tonight. We had a real fun night tonight. Let me hit something stop all the noise. But uh yeah, thank you, Shanulu, for your help tonight with Wheel of Fortune and AM Mayhem, Bractimus Prime, Gold Deadpool. Your help with the uh family feud was awesome as well. Uh thank you, Dead Ringer, for the sub, Bractimus Prime for the guest subs. Um, who else? I hope I'm not missing anybody. Um, uh, I appreciate everybody's company. I apologize if I've forgotten anybody, but I think I've covered my bases there. But thank you, everybody, for coming on, for the support, the company, and everything. We had a nice, fun night tonight with some Mario Party and stuff. Had some uh, pretty good success tonight. What the heck? I, uh, I had hard mode on for everybody and still managed to pull a win out of that. <laughs> But thank you so much. I really appreciate everything. This is a lot of fun. Um, next week, we'll be back to our normal time on Wednesday. Unfortunately, I will not be streaming tomorrow. Tonight was kind of makeup for that. Had to adjust my work schedule for the week, so it is what it is. I, <laughs> I didn't care for it either, but whatever. I'm helping out some people at work by doing this. So, um, Anyway, we'll be back Wednesday around 6 o'clock with a new game of some sort. I'll let you know on Twitter because, I, frankly, I haven't made my mind up yet. We will be diving into our long play soon, which I've selected. I'm going to try to play. Well, I shouldn't say try to play. I'm try, going to try to make my way all the way through because this is going to be a long play. But um, Final Fantasy VII, the OG. Um, I'm thinking about putting on some mods to make it look a little bit better, you know, because the old one is really clunky, but whatever. Is what it is. But um, there was one game I kind of wanted to play that might take just maybe three to five weeks you know because i only stream the one day a week but um it's an old game gear game i would really like to play that i for completely forgot about that'd be a lot of fun i mostly just want to play it for myself less to stream it but it'd be fun to show it off because it's an obscure title but i'm not gonna drop it yet because i haven't decided yet what i want to do but it, it'll be on the quota one way or another <laughs> rawr <laughs> rawr right back at you gold deadpool yeah i hope Hope your job treats you really well that you got here coming up. So that sounds like a pretty solid deal, man. 50% off all food and then you yeah, have free lunches and 17 an hour is not bad at all for starting. <laughs> but um, hell yeah. And then, like I said, this Saturday we're going to be off for D&D &D entirely. So um, we're all going to a Halloween. Well, not all of us, but most of us are going to a Halloween party at a bar that we all like. The following week we might be back for D and D. Um, the DM just kind of told us while I was streaming that he's available now, whereas he wasn't before. Um, so we're probably going to try pretty hard to play that weekend. The following weekend after that, I would like, as I said before, if people can make it, I would like to do a Halloween special and play mansions of madness for everybody. Um, I got a way to work it out where we can play it on stream and, you know, maybe we'll be able to, Hopefully you'll all be able to follow along. I hope we explain it well enough. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, I am getting kind of tired here. I hit the wall a little while back, but I was having so much fun and the adrenaline was up, but it's kind of tick, 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 tick. So everybody have a great weekend. I'll hopefully see you next week. Thank you everybody for the company and everything else. Be sure to uh, hit up my YouTube channel, which is also Inverse Thunder over on the tubes of you. I try to archive everything I do here, and I have for the past, I don't know, year and a half-ish now, give or take. Um, so if you missed anything or want more of, you know, this, who, who the hell would? But hey, you know, whatever, it's out there. <laughs> uh, I'll see y'all next time. So have a great week, great weekend, everything in between. And laters, everyone. Thanks again.